when it is left with 10 minutes i'll draw the person's the speaker's attention and two minutes or one minute if he's not stopping then i'll come and tap him and gently send him to his seat so inshallah brother Masha'Allah, thank you really very much, Mr. Moderator. I beg you, I'm waiting for the time to get started. I'm waiting for you, the time. All right. All right, in the beginning, it's only thanks that we're going to give to each and every one of you who have wasted your precious time to come and observe this program inshallah without much i do i'll first away or straight away start my name is jafar muhammad i am an author also a journalist and i am a learner on comparative religion i don't debate only christians i also engage in debate with uh, some uh, non-Christians uh, and other people from uh, different re um, religious denominations. Inshallah, I am married to a very beautiful, I mean, one of the prettiest lady. That is uh, Fridos Isa. May the Almighty God bless her for the good care she has always been rendering to me. I begin in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most ever merciful. All praises and thanks, kudus, venerations and felicitations are all due to the Almighty Allah. We praise Him, seek His help and ask for His forgiveness. There is something that we need to know. Whosoever Allah misguide, no one can guide a person to the straight path. And whosoever Allah guides, no one can misguide that person. We perpetually ask Allah to shelter his final prophet, the seal and the cream of all the prophets, being Prophet Muhammad, may the peace of Allah and other blessings be unto him, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the son of Abdullah with his divine blessing and mercy. I bear witness that there is no God, no idol, no imam, no one. No one deserves our worship except Allah. And I also bear witness that Prophet Muhammad is the final and the seal of all the prophets. May the peace of Allah and other blessings be unto him. I also really thank the hospitalities of my ever smiling idyllic wife for her, for her enthusiastic aspiration of philanthropic love, care and support that she always renders to me. May the Almighty God bless him. After giving thanks to the Almighty Allah, the owner of sovereignty, I would like to use this medium to extend my hetia salutation to all lovely Muslims, all Christians who have gathered here, the lovely members of uh, the Common Sense family, together with all Ghanaians and those who are watching us on the social media. I am so also very much happy to talk on the topic which religion and worship is accepted by God. In order to understand this topic so clearly, there is something that we always need to know. Because Whenever you are speaking English, you must know some technical terms, some technical keys in it. Now, let us look at something here. We say, which religion and worship is accepted by God? First, let us look at the pronoun, which. Which is a pronoun. So, which being a pronoun is used when asking a direct question. And every direct question mostly demand an affirmative response. Direct questions demand an affirmative response. So, this topic doesn't say, is there any religion? This topic is drawing our attention that there are religions. Let us not get ourselves confused. So, since the question is telling us there are religions, then we are also asking that which of those religions is accepted by God. There are some people with their perceptions that God doesn't exist. Good. So if someone claims God doesn't exist, the person will claim no religion exists. But we all believe there are religions. Can I 
have one member of uh, the common sense family here who is a member of common sense family here please let me let me let me let me let me talk to you please can you please get up do you believe there are religions in the world or no religions very good may god bless you we've had a testimony from a member of the common sense family that there are religions in the world so among those religions we are coming to see which of them so we are all going to establish our argument based on this which religion and worship is accepted by god since there are religion then we need to know which of them is accepted by god let us not get it twisted we have dictionaries on the tables here and then let us get into the dictionary find the meaning of religion when we finish we get the meaning of worship now in the first hand to understand this topic so clearly after knowing the meaning of which we get a note to the meaning of uh, religion and we also know the meaning of worship without that you will just come and stand here and deviate we know there are religions so we want to know which of them is accepted by god so when we talk of religion according to the miriam website let, let me get this dictionary according to the miriam western student dictionary according to that dictionary it says what it says religion is the service of god or it says religion is the service and worship of god or the supernatural it says what it is the service of god with god the almighty that is the definition from uh, the Webster's Student Dictionary. Now, we also have the Webster's Universal Dictionary and Thesaurus. Let us listen to the explanation. If possible, Mr. P. Black, if you can get me the definition of uh, worship in it. According to the Miriam Webster's Student Dictionary, it says religion is the service and the worship of God or the supernatural. To understand this topic so well, we need to define to you what religions are. Also, when we get to the Oxford Dictionary, Oxford Dictionary defines religions as the belief in and worship of superhuman controlling powers, especially a personal God or gods. You get it right. Now, let us look at worship. When we talk of worship, worship is an, worship is an act of religious devotion usually directed towards a deity. That is the definition of of worship now i've made everything so clear to you the definition of religion and then also the definition of uh, worship let us not forget there are thousands of religions in the world there are thousands of religions in the world and some of them we have christianity we have islam we have hinduism we have chinese traditional religion we have buddhism we have jainism we have um Kautainism, we have um paganism you know there are a lot we also have this neo-paganism we have the rikyo you know there are a lot we also have unitarian universalism there are a lot we cannot mention them all because of time so we want to know which of them is accepted by god but before we can know this truly i jafar muhammad i am a muslim and i stand in the face of the whole world making it very clear that among all the religions it's only islam that is accepted by god and i want someone who can challenge by bringing me only one evidence from any of those scriptures be it the, i mean the new testament be it the i mean the old testament be it um the bhagavad gita let me have let me have this book this is uh, the book bhagavad gita right good be it or any of any book any religious book on the surface of this earth i said it's only islam that is accepted by god and i'm challenging everyone in the whole world based on this topic to come and give me the actual religion which is accepted by god this is not a logical statement that someone is coming to give because whenever we are talking of religious issues we must consider using religious books so we don't deal with any logics here and i'm throwing a challenge for the second time apart from islam no other religion is accepted by god now let's see before i begin we need to hear some testimonies from the disbelievers who are not muslims some of them are christians some of them are buddhists some of them are also free thinkers let us hear their testimonies first we begin from george w bush george bush said 
Islam brings hope and comfort to millions of people in my country. It said Islam, it brings hope to millions of people in my country. He said, and to more than a billion people worldwide. He also continued by saying, Ramadan is also an occasion to remember that Islam gave birth to a rich civilization of learning that has benefited all mankind. That is from George W. Bush, the ex-president of the United States of America. We also have a testimony from uh, Pope John Paul. Pope John Paul said, the religiosity of Muslims deserves respect. He continued by saying, it is impossible not to admire, for, for example, their fidelity to prayers, the image of uh, believers in Allah, who, without carrying about time or place, without caring about time or place, fall on their knees and uh, immerse themselves in prayers. That is what Pope John Paul said about Islam. Why? Because Islam is choosing to be the number one religion in the world. So we're talking of which religion worship is accepted by God. We also have Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi being the founder of India, the one who led to the fundamental freedom and the independence, gaining the independence for Indians. He is Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi said, the more I learn, the more I find out that the strength of Islam does not lie in the sweat. We also have H. Jean Wells. H. Jean Wells also said, Islam is replete with greatness, courtesy, and fraternity. We also have Karen Armstrong. Karen Armstrong also, she said, Islam is a religion of sources. Unlike Christianity, which kept on failing and failing and failing, Islam is a religion that kept on growing from strength to strength to strength. And then we also have Leo Tolstoy. Leo Tolstoy was an Egypt, um, Russian author, a writer. He also said more better things about Islam. There is something that we need to know. The religion of Islam was not named after any person. The religion of Islam. It was not named after any person. As in the case of Christianity, which was named after Jesus Christ. Buddhism, which was named after Gautama Buddha. Confucianism, which was named after, I mean, Confucius, and Marxism, which was named after Karl Marx. Islam was not named after any person. I always throw a challenge. If anyone can get me just the name of the founder of uh, Islam, eh, I have 200 cities for that person. Even if my friend can show me the name of the founder of Islam, I make it very clear, Islam was founded not by anyone, but it is a religion that came straight away from God. So we're talking which religion and worship is accepted by God. Whenever you speak, I will make so sure to draw your attention to the topic so that it may not be that one is trying to defeat. Because when you come here, you need to say this religion is accepted by God. Because we all agreed that there are religions and constantly one of them must be accepted. Am I lying? Now, we continue. Islam was not named after the tribe of Judaism. It was also not named after the tribe of, uh, I, mean, I mean, the Hindus. Islam was not named after any tribe. Islam is a religion which was given to Adam, the first man, and the prophets of Almighty Allah. And it was a religion which was given to all the prophets and the messengers sent by the Almighty God. Mr. Abraham, with all due respect, do you believe in Abraham? You don't believe in Abraham. Do you believe in Moses? You don't believe in Moses. What is the meaning of Abraham ben Moshe? The Facebook name. So, please, I need every second. If you don't believe in Abraham, Abraham, Abraham is the Jewish. That is how they used to call Abraham. So, if you don't believe in somebody, would you adopt his name? please. If you don't believe in somebody, would you adopt his name? Abraham is Abraham. Moshe is Moses. So Abraham ben Moshe, Abraham the son of Moses. So if you don't believe in Abraham, then, you know, the, the name must be cleared from you. And besides, before I continue, I want to make it very clear my friend here belongs to a religion. He either, he is what? Either he is a Coptic Christian 
or a traditional is. Now, you see this thing on his neck. We call it the Egyptian hieroglyph ank. This Egyptian hieroglyph ank, just go to your goggles. Get the word, what religion uses the ank? Please, goggle them fast. Get me this word, what religion uses the ank? The ank is A-N-K-H. So this one is an image of some people's religion. So if you don't believe that there is a religion, how can you use or why would you use a religious object? Because we know whenever we see a cross on somebody's neck, we identify the person to be a Christian. Whenever we see someone holding the spa, we identify the person to be what? To be Muslim. And then this ank, this Egyptian hieroglyph ank, let us see if my friend truly believes in it. If he believes in it, then he belongs to either the Egyptian Coptic Christians or he is a traditionalist. And the Egyptian Coptic Christians, they belong to religion. Traditionalist also is a religion. So I'm throwing a challenge to come and show me the meaning of the ank that he is using on his neck. Let's continue. Can I continue? Uh, as I have already made it known to you earlier, you have no right to interrupt while the speaker is. So, my brother, I beg you, I beg you, give him enough space to. Thank you. Now, I have mentioned a lot of religions, and among the above mentioned religions, none of them is accepted by God except Islam, because Islam is a universal religion given to all the prophets by God. Islam is uh, the only accepted religion given to all humankind by God. The first thing one should know and clearly understand about Islam is what the word Islam itself means. We need to know the meaning of Islam. The Arabic word Islam means total submission or surrender of one's will to the only true God who is worthy of worship. That is Islam. Islam was not decided or named by any sheikh. No imam named Islam. No pastor named Islam. No one named Islam. The name Islam came from the Almighty God. And let us get to the Quran to see either it was the Almighty God who named Islam or not. Many a times when we use the word Allah, there are a lot of people who have taken it as something else. So Mr. P. Black, get me the word Allah from the dictionary. Now, Quran chapter 5 verses number 3. Listen to what the Almighty God says. Allah said, or the Quran, I'm quoting from the Quran, it says, This day I have perfected your religion for you, completed my favor upon you, and have chosen for you Islam as your religion. Quran chapter 5, verses number 3. Allah said, He has chosen for us Islam as our religion, and we are asking which religion and worship is accepted by God. So here, the Quran has made it very clear that the religion which has been chosen for humankind is Islam. So I'm yet to see if we can get any religion being chosen by God to humankind. And no one should dare say there is no religion. Because we have Christianity, we've been singing, we have Judaism, we've been singing, we have this, we have that. We know them. So if you say there is no religion, it means the grammar being written here is not well understood for you. Let us also see, you know, nowhere, nowhere in the Bible, here is it, Nowhere in this Bible, nowhere in the Bhagavad Gita, nowhere in the Talmud, can you see the word, or can you see, or can you read the Almighty God saying, the religion chosen for you is Christianity, is Judaism, is common sense family, is this or is that. But it's only, I repeat myself again, it's only the Quran that will make it very clear to you that the religion which was given to you and I, which was given to all mankind is Islam. We are, you know, we are having a scholarly debate and therefore documents or evidence, scriptures must talk. This doesn't require any logic statement. Since it entails religious issues, all our answers or all our strength must be based in the Bible, the Quran, or any other religious book. So, I've given point number one. The Almighty God said, the religion that I, God, have chosen for you is Islam. I'm waiting. The money is still here. Whenever someone shows me in any document
meant that the religion chosen for you by God is this, as the Quran claimed, the person should come and take it. And then also, let us get to the Quran. Because there is something that we need to know. Islam, Islam is an Abrahamic monotheistic religion. Islam is an Abrahamic monotheistic religion. Yes. And therefore, Abraham, according to the Almighty God, in Quran chapter 3, verses number 67, the Almighty God said, Abraham was neither a Jew nor a Christian, but he was a true Muslim. Abraham, he was neither a Jew nor a Christian, but he was a true Muslim. So according to the Quran, Abraham was a, Christ, uh, Abraham was a Muslim. I repeat my, myself again. According to the Quran, Abraham was a Muslim. And I'm also yet to see another scripture saying Abraham was Jew, Abraham was this, because it has been claimed in the Quran that Abraham was neither a Jew nor a Christian, but he was a true Muslim. The topic is which religion and worship is accepted by God. So I am telling you frankly of the religion which is truly accepted by God. And then also, you know, Isa, the son of Maryam, together with all his disciples, according to Quran chapter 5, verses number 111, they said, we believe that we are Muslims. So Jesus, together with uh, all his disciples, they agreed concisely that they are Muslims. Now, to make everything so clear to your fundamental understanding, Islam is the only accepted religion by God. Someone may ask why. I've already given a whole lot of quotations. I've cited a whole lot of examples. And now, let me continue. When we move to Quran chapter 3, verses number 85, but before then, I want my opponent to come and refute everything that I'm saying here. To come and condemn it. I wanted all my information to be refuted. So, Quran chapter 3, verses number 85, it says, whoever seeks any other religion, or whoever seeks other religion, or whoever seeks a religion other than Islam, it will never be accepted of him, and in the hereafter, he shall be among the losers. If you seek any other religion apart from Islam, that religion will never ever be accepted of you. And in the day of the judgment, or in the day of Kiyama, I'm talking of the judgment day, that person is going to be among the losers. Let us also move to Quran chapter 3, verses number 19. Listen, it says, truly, the religion with Allah is Islam. The religion with Allah is Islam. As the topic says, which religion and worship is accepted by God. So here, we have now known that the only religion preaches with the Almighty God is Allah. Uh, is Islam. The religion with God is Islam. Because based on this topic, let us make so sure we move by it without deviating. And then also, the Almighty God, all the prophets and the messengers being sent by the Almighty God, they all came with Islam. Someone may ask why. If you want to know the reason, when we get to the Quran, according to Quran chapter 43, verses number 13, it says, He Allah has ordained for you the same religion. So you and I, we have been ordained a religion. And which religion? Then it says Islam. That religion, it was ordained for Noah. So according to the Quran, Noah was a Muslim. And that which we have inspired in you, O Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And that which we ordained for Abraham. His, the name is Abraham, meaning Abraham, but he says he doesn't believe in Abraham. So Abraham was a Muslim. And then we ordained for Moses and Jesus. So the Quran is making it very clear that Islam, Islamic religion, was ordained for Jesus, it was ordained for Abraham, it was ordained for Moses, and then also Prophet Muhammad was also a Muslim. Why? Because that same religion was ordained. So there are a lot of people who have always been saying Prophet Muhammad founded Islam. Prophet Muhammad was not the founder of Islam. He was not the founder of Islam. Now, let us hear something. There are a lot of people, whenever you ask them, faith, religion, and worship is accepted by God, they will tell you they are free thinkers. They will tell you no religion. But instead, that is the most likely reason why I asked my lovely brother from the member of the common sense family, is there religions or not? He accepted by saying what? By saying what? Can I please hear you loudly? There are religions. Very good. 
So he has started by saying there are religions. So those who have been saying there are no religions, there is a message for you. When we get to Quran chapter 6, verses number 125, the Quran says, and I quote, And whosoever Allah wills to guide, he opens his breast to Islam. Here, when we use the word he opens his breast, it is a colloquial statement. It is not just breast, meaning opening his chest, opening the heart to accept it. Do you understand? So I repeat again. It says, And whoever, and whosoever Allah wills to guide, he opens his breast to Islam. And whoever he wills to send astray, as the other people, other, there are a lot of people who have gone astray. Why? Because they are not guided. They don't have the religion of peace. They don't have Islam. That is uh, Quran chapter 39, verses number 22. 39, 22. Now, it continues. So it says, So worry to those whose hearts are hindered against remembrance of Allah. For those people are in plain error. So if you are guided, you will get Islam. If you are not guided, you will split out of Islam. So let us see. Either some people will get guided here today or not. This is a pure religious debate. There is not a logical debate. If you want to quote, bring your quotation from logical books. If you believe there are no religions, if you believe you don't believe in Abraham, you don't believe in Moses, then all the scriptures contain the name of Abraham, names of Moses and other things. So bring a book that is not a religious book to show to us that this book quotes this, this and that. There is no religion. We've already understood. And then we have a brother making it very clear that there is a religion accepted by God. There is a religion. So we want to know which. I've given you quotations making it very clear that it's only Islam that is accepted by God. So I have the money here. I want someone to challenge by giving me any other religious name from their own religious book to show that there is no religion. Let us also move again. Quran has a message for us because we're talking of which religion and worship is accepted by God. Now we have now known and seen and heard the name of the only religion accepted by God. Quran made it very clear the only religion accepted by God is Islam. Now let us see which worship again. When we get to Quran chapter 22 verses number 77, listen Quran 22 77, it says all you who believe, Allah said all you who believe, bow down and prostrate yourselves and do good that you may be successful. This simply means you must bow down, you must make a rukui, prostrate yourself, make sujood, and then make so sure you worship God. After worshiping the Almighty God, make so sure you will be one of uh, the most successful philanthropists. Make so sure you do good. That is the worship of Allah. That is Salat. Let us also see, according to Quran chapter 12, verses number 40, the Almighty God is saying, and I quote, it says, He has commanded that you only worship Him. Do you understand? The Almighty God has commanded that we only worship Him. And I want to know from my brother, Mr. Abraham, do you believe in God? You believe in God. So if you truly believe in God, then the Almighty God is saying, we should do what? We should worship Him. That is the right religion. That is the right religion. But most men do not understand. Right? Allah says we should worship Him alone. Worshiping Allah alone is the right religion. That is what? Islamic monotheism. But there are a lot of people who know not. And we shall see such people here. Also, let us also see something. The Almighty God did not create you and I just for nothing. Why? Because it's not only human beings who are created by God. When we get to the Quran, there are a lot of creation of the Almighty God. But you know, there is a very great caution to you and I, which can be found in Quran chapter 51, verses number 56. Allah says, I only created jinn and men that they worship me. Allah said, He created jinn and men that they do what? They worship Him. So the reason why the Almighty God created you human being and jinni is that we should come and worship him. Now we ask, how do we worship? How do we worship? As a human being, you need to believe in the only true one God who created everything that exists. You also need 
to believe and bear witness that there is no other God who deserves to be worshipped except the Almighty God. And then we all believe that Muslim is a person who submits himself to the will of God, isn't it? A Muslim is a person who submits himself to the will of God. So, the Almighty God mandates us to pray. And then the prayers that we are going to pray to the Almighty God, He says we should pray without ceasing. Do you understand? That is why we Muslims, every day, we observe the five compulsory prayers. Either you are sick or not, you need to observe it. That is the religion and that is the worship accepted by God. So let us see, when we get to the Bible, 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verses number 16 to 18, it says, Pray without season and give thanks to God. That is the will. He says, Pray without season and give thanks to God. This is the will of God in Christ. Pray without season. How do we mean by to pray without season? It means you must not just sure you pray consistently. You need to pray every day. You pray without stopping. That is what? That is uh, the true religion of the Almighty God. So let's see. Jesus observed Salat, as Muslims do. Moses did, and all the prophets. And then, to be able to believe and worship the only true one God, the only thing you need to do is, first, you need to accept the Shahada. That is the first fundamental principle of Islam. That is the testimony of faith. You must make so sure you proclaim there is no God. My mother is not my God. My father is not God. Adam is not God. I personally am not God. You need to proclaim that God only is the only one who deserves to be worshipped. So Jesus made it very clear. Mark chapter 12, verses number 28, coming down 29 to 30. Jesus said, Shema Yisrael, Adonai Elohinu, Adonai Ehad. This simply means, hear all Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. That is the first fundamental principle of Islam. That is the Shahada. And then also, Moses also made it very clear. In Deuteronomy, he also repeated by saying, Shema Yisrael, Adonai Elohinu, Adonai Ehad. That is the first pillar of Islam. The first pillar of Islam is the Shahada. And there is no doubt about that. So Jesus, according to the Bible, Jesus prayed. When we get to the Bible, right? When we get to the Bible, according to Matthew chapter 26, reading from number 39, the Bible said, and Jesus went a little further, threw himself face downwards and prayed by saying, Oh my father, if it is possible, take away this cup of suffering from me, yet not what, what, yet not what I want, by your will be done. So he prayed, he was in prostration. Isa is what we're talking about. But I think there are some people who say Jesus was created. Subhanallah. So, let's continue. You know, when we get to the Quran, when we get to the Quran and the Bible, you know, the Bible is even making it very clear Jesus Christ was a Muslim. Because we say a Muslim is a person who submits himself to the will of God. So Jesus, according to John chapter 5, verses number 30, Jesus said, I can of my own self do nothing. What I hear, I judge, and my judgment is just because I seek not to do my own will, but the will of Allah who has sent me. So a person who submits himself to the will of God is who? A Muslim. A person who submits himself to the will of God is Islam. Uh, is Muslim. Now, let us see. When, uh, when we get to the Quran also, when we get to the Quran also, the second pillar of Islam being Shahada is in the Quran and we can also get it in the Bible. I've already quoted John, sorry, I've already quoted Quran chapter 22, 77, making it very clear, you should bow down, prostrate yourself, do good, that you may be successful. Now, let us also see what the Bible says about Salat. Jesus performed it as I said that, as I cited an example by telling you John chapter 26, 36. Coming down to 39, Jesus did that. Do you understand? So, here, we shouldn't get ourselves confused based on the topic here. The topic is which religion and worship is accepted by the Almighty God. So, I have been able, you know, I quoted, not from logic, I quoted the Quran, making it very clear that Islam is the only religion accepted by God because one of the members of the common sense family said there are religions. There are religions. So, if there are religions, which of them is accepted? 
So Quran has made it very clear that it's only Islam that is accepted. So we are yet and we are still waiting to hearing a religion that is accepted by God. There is not, this does not require any logic tests. There is a pure religious debate that we have. So the scriptures must speak so that we get from the either the Quran or the Bible whatsoever which religion is accepted by the Almighty God. So I make it very clear we have different objects for different religious denominations. For some Muslims, we use the Quran, the Christians use the Bible and other things. You know, some people use the rosaries as you can see. So we are asking the traditionalists are those using the ankh. So if you use the ankh, you are also part of them. Yes. So you just check it up. You just get the meaning of uh, the Egyptian hieroglyph ankh. It is a religious object for some people. Now let's continue. Before one prays, what are the requirements from the person before he prays? Before you pray, you must make so sure you perform ablution. You purify yourself. Because you cannot just go before the Almighty God with death. You need to purify yourself. That is what we call the self-purification. That is the ablution. So it's only Islam that is making very clear to us that whenever you are going before the Almighty God, you need to purify yourself. Make so sure you become so neat. Now, I have a question to ask. Let's take it for instance. This question goes to the common sense family people. Let's take it for instance. We have two objects here. This one is a meat. This is also meat. Now, you've come. This meat is nicely covered. And this meat is not covered. Flies are just roaming over it here and there. So with your common sense, which of them are you going to buy? The common sense family people, I'm asking. If you go to the market, camel glass cold store, and then they have their meat. Another cold store aside, selling meat. And let's take it, this meat is covered nicely. The meat is covered nicely. And this meat is not covered. And flies are just roaming all over it. Just which of them are you going to buy? The covered or the uncovered? The covered. Do you understand? So that is Islam for you. So Islam teaches us. Islam, it teaches us self-purification, meekness. You know, you must make so sure you always, as a woman, you always need to cover yourself so nicely. Why? Because that is the only religion accepted by God. And whatsoever you are doing as a Muslim, you need to do it with what? You need to do it with neatness. So I stand before the whole world, making it very clear, it's only Islam that is accepted by God. I've given a lot of quotations from the Quran, making it clear that the only religion accepted by God is Islam. So I'm waiting to hear it from anyone, from any document, or from any graphic, or from any book, for us to see either so so and so religion is accepted by God. Once again, let us not forget the topic. It says which religion and worship is accepted by God. So I have been able to emphatically state that for you the only religion accepted by God. So based on that topic, we wanted to see since there are religions, both cannot do that, both cannot be accepted. Among all those religions, it's only one that must constantly be accepted and even that is accepted by God, that is Islam. As I've given a whole lot of quotations to back my theory. So I will end it up and uh, wait to see either. We're going to get any quotation from any document. Any quotation from any document showing this religion is good, this religion. We all believe there are religions, so we want to know which of them is accepted by God. How many minutes more? What? Three minutes. So, with the remaining three minutes, let us see something. We are still talking of uh, this topic. So, we've spoken of the first pillar of Islam. We got it in the Bible. Second pillar, we got it in the Bible because the Quran is talking of them all. And then, the third pillar of Islam is what? The third pillar of Islam is the Ramadan that we are observing. Even the Quran, we have been mandated by God 
to do it and also when you get to the Bible also it has been mandated. That is the worship of the Almighty God. We don't worship the Almighty God with drums and other things but whenever you want to worship you must make so sure you will be in an absolute calm and what? Submissiveness before you worship the Almighty God. So I am repeating again by making it clear Islam is the only religion accepted by God based on the topic. The topic doesn't say, is there any religion? No. Let us understand the grammar written on it, on the poster. So if a member of the common sense family had made it very clear that there is a religion, then I'm telling you that according to the Quran, the Quran said the only religion accepted by God is Islam and the Almighty Allah has done what? Almighty Allah has perfected for us our religion that is Islam. The Almighty God has perfected for us our religion, that is Islam. I will end it up here with a very great greetings of peace. That is Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. The brother has finished his submission. He spoke and then he quoted intensively from the Bhagavad Gita from the Puranas, from the Bible, from the Quran, just to prove that Islam is the only religion that is acceptable in the sight of God Almighty. Now, when the brother was making his submission, a brother heckled from the audience. But actually, he was trying to prove, he raised the point to prove that the brother believes or belongs to a religion. So, it was also overruled. And please, I'm still reiterating. Do not try to heckle the speaker. If you are a Muslim and brother stars, please don't heckle him. Have patience. As he finish, we will also give you the opportunity to take part in the debate. Because you ask questions. Okay? So, inshallah, brother, Avram, all is yours. Inshallah. Um, but Please, that it was agreed between him and Brother Jafar that you can speak any language as you wish. So that he wants to use the English, the three language. But I was suggesting that this is an international program, especially this particular TV, Hijra TV. It is on satellite, and people are following it right now. And besides uh, this, uh, your Facebook live things people are following but the brother says see, that he wants to speak three so oh brother jafar too is trying to have an objection to that cannot understand our indigenous language here, they must also need to benefit from the program. Okay, actually as, 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 as the moderator of the program, 
as the moderator of the program, I stand neutral. And for that matter, since the first brother used English language, then the second brother too must use English language. That's all. Uh, it shouldn't it shouldn't sound as if I can't speak English. But I want my brother Jafra to understand something that an agreement is an agreement. The wife is the witness when we met for the meeting. You see, it it in a way it will it will sound even insulting for for, for, for blacks to educate our people in the white man's language. I can speak English perfectly, but with all due respect, you see, that's why when you brought out the first poster with the inscription strictly English, I called you and told you this was not the agreement. So we did another poster, removed the strictly English, but you intentionally printed this one with strict English. You are being justice to the program. But for the benefit of the doubt, I want my brother to understand that I can debate in every language. I will speak English. No. I'm done. Let me continue. Let me continue. Let me continue. Uh, we used five minutes. So five minutes will be subtracted from his time. It will be added to his time. Five minutes will be added to his time. Inshallah. Thank you. I think those of you on Facebook will see how people are right commenting, speak tree, speak tree, speak tree. But for the sake of the program, I want my brother Jafar to know one thing. When you say you are religious, when you say you are a leader of a religious group, learn how to be sincere and honest. Yeah. No, you said, you said, you see, we shouldn't, no, no, you said, oh, uh, Brother Jafar, Brother Jafar, hello, Salaamu Alaikum, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Hello. Uh, hello, 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 Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Brothers, it's very unfortunate. Brothers, 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 have patience. Inshallah, the thing is settled. So, brother Ben Moshi, you have the opportunity to either blend to speak English or tree but um, okay some of us as the moderator my tree is four by seven so inshallah yeah it was your four tree now the echo uh 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 yeah yeah dear be our own baby i yeah a baby or how you boo best say i deal with fear a yeah Oh, Mr. Mo, assuming in a especially Islam, and 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 brother, brother Jafar, I'm saying, a debate. Ah, one recited the the Arab 
version of the Quran. Oyusu English. Eh yeah, debate is not every. So Omo Kachem me Abraham say, once you can't read up, up men claim say unim Islam. So who to me cast out same way? At the chair as Antony, I own to me kind Arab. Wabaji enkri osuma tumu wititi na tem. What you say? I was so see Arab and so why enkri money. And I own to me kind Arab inti. What better than enkri money no? Oba so chere say sebe wajimi ana debi. Nemun say si America say. I'm not translating Quran. I be about to cast him. Say the baby ini ah onti Arab no ono so bad then. Oba ti ati ya. Aha. So I will I will do my best to blend the English. And the tree, so that my brother will, 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 will yeah, will be satisfied. Uh -huh. Um, so only in Kremuni, in Kremuni, here debate. Let's hear, um, many are among Kremu for Christ or any common sense family for. So only Christoni and an Kremuni, here debate. Now, a quote Bible and a Quran, the pair, no say, Allah says. Allah says, God says, nobody has heard God speaking before. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. What they bring in? Obi and Tanya come on da. Say, say, Anipa, you will be asy. Yeah, yeah. Seven billion over. Not one single person. And put me a pen and say, I have seen God or heard God speaking before. Yeah. Name mum. Me me ni pi eno no. Ye pe we asy no. And your better two books will be ah your Frebaco Quran, your Frebaco Bible, and ah that books ah books no ne claim say nyang po watasa Emma and Crawfati. Me catcher will be ah no religion is the truth, but there is truth in every religion. Oh yeah, yeah. No religion is the truth. Or sumbi anywa eno kure. Yeah. Topic and I say which religion and worship. Accepted by God. We need to know. Eh, kase. A small area. A group of four thousand. Over four thousand religions. Obi e claim say. We di ane e correct. Na sa wam be jini di ane niya. Obi ko bu insa mi. That is in claim of four. Mo wa mo heaven. Ene mo bu insa mi. Yeah. Let's say. Christo ni wam be in claim of niya. Obi ko in claim of four. Mo bu insa mi. Ana Christo four so. Omo wa omo heaven. Any omobu in some gym, I express a saying cremony. One day, a cryptonia over course up in some genim. That's how you create religion. Oh, when you're when you're me, now when you're needing, now when you're a book, now when you're a prophet, now when you're a heaven, now when you're a hell. Yeah, no, maybe I'm a say, me, me, or soon be em. I was born a Muslim, yeah, woman cremony, me, dear, and Casa, Ebe, Ali, Ibrahim, me, then the Ibrahim, and I'm a papa, the Ali. But when say who goes to a, yeah, they will say name and a friend. Yeah, Ali, no, I ever came so. Ebi Abraham Ben Moshe. I had been a minyai. Enkre mosum mayosum. Yeah. Fetch me in kola brim. The entire mayosum enkre mosum ni. Right from my childhood, me wadi ebi wom na wa we siyan diya kakrano. Me ye Sagittarius eh unim horoscope wa me ye Sagittarian. Yes, I'm crossed one. Yeah, yeah, I'm false yeah. Who say and say and yah yah yah? The person here are they out of our own free will? And the problem is that no, say the person for three aba, now you boom it and many sala, you boom it and many cop we makarantano. I never understood it. And the you boom it, boom it, boom it, boom it, many sala. Me just case me cop makaranta, no makwa kobo munchendi. And the bebre wademwa, mu ye inkre mufu because. You were beaten to become a Muslim. Yeah. Yebu, yebu. And why in Kremuni na wenyi? Oh yeah. Enti, it is not a matter of choice. It was a matter of upbringing. Yeah. Meaning, a yebu parent and a shell and why in Kremuni? Aye. Mami misa a question. In Kremuni a wote ya? A yebu utu in Kremu fofiye. Mami misa a. Se penti koso sofo ene uwa. Anka se si ye. Oko a sole ben. Penti koso. Yeah. Se roman katholik ni. Ene wuhuwa, anka wuko Roman. Sa anka ya ya tide muha, ya wu ya wu India. India, anka ya di India sumechi. That means, baby ya ya wu wu tu ya no. Environment no. Ene osume wu wu no. 
Eluna, you do program the brain which is the manual for life. Yeah. Why not you China? Chinese. Nobody. Why? You have not studied China uh -huh. and you were not born in China. It is the brain that programs the tongue. We we'll touch them away. In the brain, we shall Casa ye can wo area ho. Me, me, ti, me, ti, asante kasa pa. Edi inti ya. Na me ma amene me papa. Omu ye busy. Inti debi ya no mo kwa e juma. No mo e jamia ma asante ni. Inti ya ye den. Asante ni no. E ne te te mi ama ne me kasa. Obe e gen se me ye asante ni. Inti e ye programming. En kremosom. Mi ni ye 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 no. E na me shi ya koran. Edi inti ya. Mi ye kristo ni. Mi jai kristo som. E na me ben ji ufu ono. Na me kwa kwa ben ji ufu ono. Na nka me di mi di ima. E ye ali Ibrahim no. E na. Mi Facebook name. Na e nye Avraham bin Moshe. Me first Facebook name. Na e ye ali Ibrahim. Ya. Me di kwa ji ufu ono in chanye no. E na wan ji u ni kachila me se. Me di mi se ji ufu ono. E ni nkremo fa wo problem. E di se me di se di eno kwa. Omo nye me. E di mi mpe ji wish name. Na me fe nko. E di e ye. Jewish rabbi di ene tu mi di Avraham ben Moshe se mi mfe eno nye mi Jewish name eno na mi di kreti Facebook account a akano eno nanchayin the name doesn't matter it is the knowledge you said that matters ya fobi kwa mi nyame no ya kronfoa it has been to do with the nyame ya fobi kwa kubo insam no ya di enyo kupopa it doesn't affect the name ya mfe eno nton chayin afe me nyi di me won say bible no problem won ho yeah. ah me kan bible na e ma me ti asole na me wa asole ba ko ba ko nine nine branches me sue dey we say no problem we bible na ho me be in chief ufo no me say one other problem e na me see e dey me ba me chi na enkremo som na ye wu mi tu na me chi ya after me ba be sue the only difference na say me nyi e wie no ah ma dwen no aye matured no say na me be check e quran the problem of Quran is the problem of the Bible. The same thing in the Quran. I have my opinion. I have my opinion. Prophet Muhammad peace be unto him. No religion is the truth. But there is truth in every religion. You don't think that you are in the Quran. And you don't think that you are in the Quran. You don't think that you are in the Quran. You don't think that you are in the Quran. Don't you think I saw your Christ on me? And today, the name of you, you know, now you are wrong. The name of somebody didn't make sense. Yeah. Now I'm coping. I'm not being casai. Even if I have friends in Angie Gabriel, I'll be any damn how we see another day. Not even my friend, the Sheikh, has seen Angie Gabriel before. He had it in a book. And I don't be a maker. Any God whose supernatural powers and miracles are only seen in a book. And not in reality is equal to a God who never existed. Prophet Muhammad won't say me now what they say. O Koshia and Gabriel, I will keep you now. We need hope. Yet the attitude of Anaka, Prophet Muhammad, peace be unto him. What now? The flying horse, the flying donkey. So I be going heaven. I yet now what say? We need eyewitness. And I yet I yet no. And I yet yet. And you may make some. Now I'm coping up on the one more religion. Me mum. On my own, a brain, a brain, any other Bobra. Now me say, catch them, boom. God didn't create man to worship Him. Yeah. No, match them with the India. Yanko Paul, according to religious people, most of Yanko Paul were angels. Now above four no summon was wrong. Now Yanko Paul probably has some now. Above four no we encounter bono or a day when he power. Man was created for a purpose. The purpose. It's to make the world a better place. Love nature. Serve mankind with honesty and sincerity. Oh yeah. Asa. Don't make so many young couple. The woman now the boss woman. Oh yeah, Rema Allah. The one had the boss because Allah. Don't make sin in Yama. Don't make consume man. Don't make pray man Allah. Oh yeah. No amount of money and Adam Allah are in this world. Yeah. And today no prayer on chain. The prayer on chain no. A lot is in Islam. Eti na nkremo som. Mu main pillar. Eye zakat. Ya adwaye. Untu mi ye nyanko pa adwaye. Enti uye doktar. Ude sevi ni pa. Mi ni mta nyanko pa me kase miti pa eme. 
na wafro so ho akwa ko ne pane god daddy need the doctor and ti yawa ha se ye be som ye ho religion e dem papa bu na religion brings division me pa cha o ye christo ni wa akwa ko chia e bi anfa na sa wa ko em kumase mo we wa bai we be ne ho fe o se ge ye pepe no wa fre no mo atena se one na kasa o se opɛ o wo ko bi san se ye fre wo san ya ajua pokria o kwa asole ben pentecost ye fre wo san abubakar yusuf bi ye nkremoni awale ya no e be ba so ane ba so god is not the author of confusion oh yeah ya me na me som no no o ma ya dwen a ye fom bo bra adwen no e ya de mi no na wo ya wo the good inclination and the evil inclination oni pe bi a ade a wo be ye ano wo te kasa mi enu ye ye menye menye ye ye menye menye na wan kasa wetie kasa bi enu no na we tu su ba ko enti de wo be tu su no e ye papa wa na wo tu su e ye bone nso a wa na wo tu su me bra pe ngi kan se mi wie na ma tra wo de enti a we need the brain with all due respect yeah. not the quran nobody here was born with a quran but everybody was born with a brain hmm. that is the manual for life ya ti dem ha say ahabon ahabon you don't need in gabriel to tell you say ahabon you need your senses yeah ti obi twa ka kwem na obo de later to say on can say hey quran say e ya ye fast na be ka say hey but wait me ye ntam jimi ene wan adwen na nya dwuma eti body ne be den e be be bre we need the brain ma men che wade bi twa de mistake a en kremo fo muni me debate a mo ye ne se se muni me ye debate a na se ko tu bible bible mi ni ni oni me kasa o se ko tu bible no ti eno de amam ko tu kra ve ma men che de ntia we need the brain mi be ko tu quran verse bi kese we why na we wi ase a onyi ntum quran chapter 6 verse 152 me see yenya akwen brain even your quran even when you read it you still need the brain to understand it and not the quran na kura e ki claim say wa we say quran no e free allah tre one contradiction pe e di ntia o se wodi akan kan you should have been at with him no who mistake ba ko quran ni mu atotne yeah me who mistake the brain but anya na ye ne ne e no be what na topic so problem dia na me shan kremoni ba ko a wa explain one contradiction in my presence uh-huh. baby na daniel na sasem it kind of quran chapter 6 verse 152 eh uh-huh. we see and come come not near to the offer's property tie quran chapter 6 152 i say come not near the offer's property obi ane mame ene ne papa ewu eja no yeah quran me say say eja pade no Can one be GM free about running same? Yeah. Me pa chao. As some way, it make sense and it make sense. Obi ane mamene ni papa uno, e uwe jano. Ne japa, ye je. Then the Quran me say, Obi ane mamene ni papa uwe jano. Ne japa, ye. Can one come to a show? Except to improve it. Except to improve it. Oba, e japa, ye ne huwa. A je sa, o be ke, e japa, ye ne suwa mano. Ne japa, ye no. Abba emfaso e dia ma akoda no me pa cho we e ye good and e ye bad e ye good e ye perfect kind until he or she attains the age of full strength and she say akoda no ne ma me ne papa wu na wo be japade ne ho a say e ye company e na ne papa jama na wo be she company ne so a e die ko se say abofra no wo be nya 18 years wa ye mature na wo de ne japade amma na me pa cho quran verse we e make sense 100% oh yeah enti wey me de be ye adwuma de enti a se nyankopo ba bo soro ne asase no prove whether islam is the religion approved by god you are quoting your own book to prove your own belief system that is a ye prove what you go no muslim can prove islam without the quran oh yeah no christian can prove christianity without the bible Aye. it is only free thinkers who will talk to you and prove to you our belief system with even nature even nature will tell you what we are saying is true another quran verse in quran chapter 14 verse 4 me me nia 
um, Jafar kwa kutu, the same as him. Um, Ewa Quran chapter um, 39, verse 22. Eh, ah, ti asime shewa. Okay. The Quran was revealed to the people of Arab. Eye Arab fuon kuwa diya. Ose, eh, ya wadiya bebi anana abete. Me kutu fi Quran ni matra wu. Oko ji ufuwa ni nchanya. Omu si tora ni yomu diya. Omu nkumu diya. Ente Quran no ti. Kan yesede. Quran chapter 4. Verse number 4. Enye 4, 4. Be black. Focus. Why? Enye 14, 4. Ti. Shemi na kain. Aha. Quran chapter 14, verse 4. Quran 14, 4. Ti ha. Kain. And we sent not a messenger. Oh see. And we sent not a messenger. Except with the language of his people. Except with the language of his people. Quran na se. Nya unko pa un suma prophet bi ada. Nwa ba suma prophet ya. Un suma prophet ne ko enkrofoa a. Eye omu kasa ho. Ya. Ta cho asante fo. Mo prophet wen. Kora ne pa so achina se. Se nya unko pa un be suma prophet bi ya. O yi sa enkrofoa ne ni pa. No di omu kuro omu kasa. E di ako kasa a chero mo. Se de be ya se brombe e den. Ombe ti ya. E nan pa se me chero se. Kora no ya di ma rabo fo unko an. Ne nya Allah bi ane de. Wei kora ne bai. Ya. Enji gebre bi ama. Wai. O ni pa. O di information ni ma prophet Muhammad. Peace be unto him. E ya waraka. Enji de koran. Eh. The writing of the koran. Seized after the death of waraka. Ya. Waraka. No ye ji u ni. E ti wano. E no kan the stories in the bible. E ti wano prophet Muhammad. E ti wano me. O making mistakes me bre no. O ti wano me ti wano yon me sha o. Ya. Macam mistakes in the Quran, tu yang macam tu. Okey, se uji asum bidi. Nau okey kain asum ni book na. You read the book with your heart, not with your brain. Ente se ceremony okey kain Bible la. Ode na jen okey kain. Ope mistake yehu. Sana se Kristo ni sofa Quran na. Ope mistake yehu. I just I will start to check it. Why? It will be amba baby ya. No mugu demwa. Obi yang unji kebre da. Eh, kain. And we sent not a messenger. And we sent not a messenger except with the language of his people. Except with the language of his people. Now, just say, ye be you will do for at your man or man. Ye you will be a oti or mokasa. And me be say say, we are santini and ye are santi for prophet many a shuman mamu. Many a eh, and I say before prophet many a baho achim for dagati gonja mamprusi. Islam and Christianity are foreign culture to the black man. Yeah. now started with slave trade. Slave trade. Yeah. before they started and said before Yeah. Long story. Don't allow a book to limit your understanding. Yeah. Me bin Moshe. Me we preconam. Me we preco because Maria. Mini yali ya me yale. Ena mini bienti ya. Eni se. Me wi preko nam. Wi nkre moni. O wi preko nam. Because the Quran says. You are not thinking outside the box. Religion puts you in a box. And limit your understanding. Enti ano. Ose yashma wo di yifuwa. Ya te language. E ya ne nkro fo kata ne mano. Tua chwe. In order that. In order that he might make the message clear for them. In order that he might make the message clear for them. And nti na mr yenke chi kata no. Ni eni yenu anu gan na fo ne kasa. Ose so sma prophet na. Odi ni kuro mu kasa ne mano. Let the bayan kuro fa ne bayan den. Ebe ti kasa. There are a lot of Muslim tiye who doesn't even understand Arab. Oh. But they call themselves Muslims. Me na ni yenke ceremony. Fati akwa na meka. Won ti ase. Oh. Because we are poor school. When you make a mistake, you make a mistake. No, Mr. Mama, three years la, we can't say we can't na oti osi debi. No, Mr. Good. No, Mr. Mama, Quran one what kind da? Osi min kind da. No, Mr. Mama, osi ma wudi ech. No book na kasa one kind ti asi. Osi si ya umi tumu. Should I stay in a religion because I was born into it? No. Yeah. Learn how to question your belief system. Yeah. I say, aha. Uh and -huh. I see problem. Uh -huh. yeah. Say, Islam, po, every Nyankopon, every Allah. Now me, Avram bin Moshe, my name, Allah, 
onto me nsa me ntu bo nsa me jemu da o debi debi me ka bi o mi be ko tu koran tie sa me islam en e free nyan kopa o na me my stop islam allah or the metu bo nsa me jemu a e nye ye o ni me ntia kan no ntie then allah misleads whom he wills then allah mislead whom he wills who are allah pesa wo yera no be ma wa yera plato and guides who whom he wills and no be allah pesa wo je no so o be je no tin pa cha allah e be je wa e ya mata no choice na se e ya se that be a selection to finish na se allah pesa wo je wa e be je wo o pesa wo yera Obama wayara enti mi Abraham mayara no according to Islam why na ma mayara la it is judgment day Allah say Abraham be Moses Abraham ala kwa nyen kremoni e wa no ma fa pi black pi black Quran chapter 14 ayat 4 king kai near my them no ma ka say Allah aya wo na wo say dia wo o pesa wo ya <laughs> on common platforms then we battle with belief system yeah ya ba han na bi ka eh be bia mo kone de o mo pento kwa o he o bi na me se no 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 sebe sebe bi wiase duro no sebe 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 o mo wodi nkremo som e ko nto kwa no e yo bi a onti islam wase aha ti me islam ya di tuya se ma yira na ya brother jafar e twi me e de me ba nkremo som a me ne me se wa ya de e ma allah Allah kura be bona ba so e ma Allah kura ka cha Jafar se Jafar me na me ji nipa na me mo bi yira Avram na mama na yira ba wu Jafar wa yade wa twana ba enti to for you enti eh ya to aso mi ji di se ba na ti tu e ya be be ka se ni mi si kupo ni ho be bi I believe there is a creator. Come mm. on, to tell you that when the creation there must be a creator. Yeah. So me be actually say see I say. Paper we and we a few so and a buy. And a try na ya tro no. And one na tro e and a better wa. I am the greatest fool. Mm. Obi ko Jewish rabbi be thing. Nipa no se nyankopo ni ho. Yeah. Eno ka che rabbi ne se. Hey, rabbi. Na mo na mo se nyankopo bi wo ho osoro ni asase no. Eno se eh no se mo gi mi pa. Mo wu nyankopo da. Ena rabbi ne se da bi. Mo atene kasa no se da bi. Ito se o improve nyankopo nkyere no. Ena rabbi ne ka che o hene ne se. O pe so. O ma no 5 minutes. O ma excuse. Ena o hene ni pie. O hene ni pie e pe. Emma rabbi nefa pen or throw and throw be yeah what am i trying to say or throw peter piper pick a pair of pickle pepper a pair of pickle pepper peter piper pick if peter piper pick a pair of pickle pepper where is the pair of pickle pepper peter piper pick and not troy and not the two ho and a okay say nana brem and or hinnan by so he didn't bring up and no catch the ohene ne say onje no kan kan and ohene de kan kan peter piper pick a pair of pickle pepper and no say ah why na true the beautiful way and a rabbi ne say enye obi an e true pen na no sole and no okotro e na ohene ne say kwasea pen we betu mi asole na wa true beautiful story say no say so we be so catch am say so beautiful story four letters to me makeka how much more this whole universe any emuniyama into common sense tells you there is a creator oh, yeah. when you see a table you don't need to see the carpenter no there is carpenter mm -hmm. once you see a table there is a carpenter yeah. you don't need to see it 
Yeah. 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 Yeah and hell. Why mm. near to moi? Obe ko bun sam jim. Sremo. Then ko another point. Ti ye ye jidi se obo ade bi wo ho. Afey my problem any say Islam eh the religion of Allah. Ne free nyan power. There was a Quran no. It make sense. Yeah. But yo en kremo fo am wo dem mo ha. Me be some question. We ba o wo ba girl. O no wo 24 years and a 22 years and now we're going to go here a brand here be i don't know if you're in the room we're going to go here 30 years but oh yeah yeah no one day now on him obana about how at the end i will say yeah 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 yes Your friend, your boss, your phone, me, no, no. Now you are not funny, you can. Now on share, oh, oh, now I am not funny. Anna, my boy. Yeah. But your answer, bro, we man, you know, we are what say, oh, boy, no, pay your time here. But your, say, we ba, we go see young criminal, no, we are not funny, no, we are not funny, we see young people. To marry or not, excellent. But you may want say, "Mano, the same answer." Yeah, they be a make us agree now. You my body ne bre. Quran, I must see every Allah or betray the enemy. Na munchu subako. We are in the age of information. We are in the age. Of reasoning, mm. Quran chapter twenty-four, verse two. But how? Eddie and Egamai, Egamai, only your bank one and another in religion. Anna, yeah. Yeah, Papa, my excellent answer. Yeah, bro, my the same answer. The Quran, kind. Quran twenty-four. Quran twenty-four. Number two, verse two. The fornicators, the fornicators, the fornicator, and the fornicator. The Obama. Yeah, yeah, no one deny any yeah, other. Any bare manner, only what bare manner? Yeah, no. Flog each of them. Flog each of them with a hundred stripes. Hundred stripes. Yeah. Quran is say, what bare? Yeah, no one deny any other. Now we see, we see now. Mum for mum for. Mum mum we see hundred. Is this the higher sense of justice? Hmm. Tell me, catch what I say. We, okay, no Zongo community will will do this. Ah. Now, yeah, the wadang phone nege ato ho. Yeah, be bu amo. Me faru. Onye no huadi inti yeah be bu amo. Now me ba manu kwa meche sa hundred kens no kwa ba no wale ni biyo. Yeah, yeah. You now one round hundred. Okay, where you are, Juma, and Kamu, and Mugu, them, including the Sheikh, and Kaya, boom, we think up, up, up. They do Ramadan, and what can Juma and I say? Why are you not heading this up? Tell me, boy, catch them here. They do Ramadan, and what can I say? We don't them. Charlie, we do Salah. They get for, they get for no call me. We finish that Zumiya. No, 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 no. Baby, Tianka, Kremo, for Mugu, you be in which not designs to honor. Higher sense of judgment. That is why I am saying, say, say me, Ali, me fa Quran, na me kenyanya, baby, a make sense, no me fa, na baby, to say hundred kings, no, me into, yeah, 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 me ba berkisu, oba koko kama, uche na nintu abe gani, na berkisu, matese onyem. I'm afraid they're man on the barricades. I'm on budget hundred lashes. Many way. Mom, me point you. Next one. Yeah, 
ti kronfo Quran si yen twane nsa mhm mema dwen ye common sense ye betumi a ti kronfo se ni pa ye ti a common sense tre se ye nya system of justice yeah ti na police station wo ho enti ti a chere se ye ti kronfo na ye mfa ne nko ye prosecute no na ye mfa ne no ana se ye mani nam sa punishment no e be teaching a lesson yeah say o pye free prisoner obetu na baba dane shake ana se wo so for na wa be kenya ye ni mko fo be pama ko je laba ada dane nkrem fo a o preach yeah ye ni be bro mo ko je laba ada ni aso fo ba se koro ne kasi ye ntwa ne nsa na o wi ade ni ntwa ne nsa ba ko na o se ko wi ade ni ntwa ne nsa mienu no na ye yi ni fi prison wo ba na mu ko ko preach ya obeda so speakers mu dia bo am e bi kran ko be carpenter na kwa ye kunwa oh. i don't need this book any channel san no sa we mu dey ejumo zongo aka be shian kro for no hand <laughs> because emra ni di we di o e ya samu o ah ti ba cho me perverse na ba um adultery e wi na ma ba e ma ne so oh oh um okay me pe me pe sa verse na ba eh aha am se ma tro ni be brenti ya nko another one en en kremo fo ma no me bi tamu question Me ko ye debate bia e ya me sesa be bia me yi me argument ni fri e me bra Jafar pe e na me de me last debate no e nsoma me kan na na me wi it oh ya en kremo fo ma na ti wo no wan no person ni kuno bo no we wo kuno so katu wo na na wi fi na o ka benku o ba o so o be bo wan no person ni kuno bo no o na so wo kuno bo o mo okay Bacho se bu na mwati o. Ai. Ti mwati sawa. We are your special request. Okay. Um Oh. Huh. Aha. Chapter 5 verse 38. Kan ensa nene. E wi ani akọ oba no. Oh yeah, na pa mo ho say yes. Washen. Kai, Quran 538. Quran chapter 5 verse 38. And as for the male chief, as for the male chief. Thief and a chief. And to be black. Eh. Uh, why? Eh, uh, kai man. And as for the male chief, as for the male thief, Quran for them, eh. And the female thief. Any Quran for oba cut off from the wrist joint cut off from the wrist joint which and the sharia law and you and human cross pocket city ano we say which she from for oba bema o de nsa to ho mo ntwa mfri ha kind their right hand their right hand as a recompense for what for that which they committed aha to try and nsa no next time obey steady i don't need a god Who couldn't handle Satan himself? Ah, this is the concept I don't understand in religion. Who in your kupawa? Who say we in the future? Oh, Bob Bonsam, who in Misa Kwei Baya Bonsam? Oh, Baba Bajit Nipa. Oh, Baba Nipa ya Kurunfo. Oh, Baba Nipa. Oh, Baba Ana Nyango Yere. And now we in your kupawa. And now we Bob Kwei. Oh, Bob Kwei. Now we in your swadi wa heaven. When to men and na, what tambon samwa? Who did it? Yeah, chere form. Awo na ma yeng. Yeng na yeng yeng ohe no. Na bon samwa ano ati ati yega. O se mi mum na adu be tu jam. For mum say to tell you, this doesn't make sense. Yeah. Samuti we tu mu a said the ati ni. Ati say wone. O papa. O awo dying. O ma. O mu o mu dying. 
Ena papa no oni wadanfo ena te dine him wadanfo ena wadanfo no odani kobra wadanfo ne dani kobra no opɛ wo papa na kawo opɛ wo kawo papa ne so ukura sekan anke wo se wukun wo wo papa no wenku wo no ena ade sekan no wudi pɛja wo wo no na wo kobi wo ma ne dan ena wo tu wo wo no gu wo ma ne dan mu ho ena aka gate ne tum ena kobi e window na se Mustafa Amina Ahmed ma ben fo na dane wowo na ma to na to dem ho na wo a wo ni mu a obema wowo na ka wo no se e messiah show no wo ya be fra ba ko dan ni mu a ka wa e ti papa wo window na ji ka se dada wo usu jimi fo de ye nsi e dida we told you respect let us use this logic Yeah. to judge our belief system. Oh yeah. Mimi eh osun biara aya wo watum. Na wo an question. Na wo ye silent even in Islam in a way. It is haram to be questioning your your your, your imam. Ah. Watch na wadie. Yeah. Wo question kakra pe yishuru. Yishuru say. Menti asia si yishuru. Yeah. Na tani yishuru. Na wo ire aya nkwa nchini nim. Wo fra na mi na ada na osi yishuru na di na ye yishuru di yeah ti mesra mo media na se de nti amam for dem ye debate na se i am questioning belief system even in a way even if se me ye bon samwa i am forcing you to think oh yeah another one she wo yire quran chapter 4 verse 34 men pesa me bra jafar da ba ha aba da ka che me se she wo yire no o be chire Entire movie ani shini bi aya shino eya no mo explain it say oh daddy enye sa no ti eya beat her lightly na cha say we yire na so ten a eya fa bi beat say my afi na fa bo no na o oba 7 years grade my afi be bo na we yire ti enye kan quran chapter 4 quran chapter 4 what is proverbs quran ah people like na quran proverbs wo Oh, now sudden I. Let's see Proverbs chapter. Quran. Eh ya Quran, eh ya Proverbs. Can we not keep black Quran 434. Quran chapter 4, verse 34. Men are the protectors. Oh, say men are the protectors and the maintainers of women. And the maintainers of women. Eh ya no kure. Yeah. Oh ya bema, wo wale wo yire ya, oba no pade mi enu, o protection any maintenance of man e dia ne e di obema na taade ahye man ne ni age e wa wade enim na wasan e protect no e bra owo ahoje nti e no kure to as well because because allah has made one of them to excel the other nti o say allah ama be ma no aye kese e esne oba me awari mu no quran chapter 4 verse 34 434 434 let's just say awari mu no oba na ese be ma se ma dia tum to aso and because and because respect to the poor be ma no e na o spend e do support oba no from their means from their means therefore the righteous women are devoutly obedient to allah o say enam sa se mu nti en kremo fo ma na o mu ye kronkron no o mu devoted to allah and to their husbands and to their husbands let's just say en kremo ni oba oba kronkron no obi enidie ma ala na odi enidie ama ni kuno magiatum eye no kre kan ye and tight in the husband's absence na sa oba na oye oba papa no teni kunu ni wa odi ni ni hunu na nche basa basa eye no kre so so what allow others them to guide what allow others them to guide their chastity eh eh their trust property eh eh up to those women on whose part you be able to conduct or say ema kronkron no wa kom ho asem yeah se eh ni kunu ni wa o hwe ni ho yie na be me bia ne na na e na ni kunu agapade e so obo ho ban o se ema na mu be wuru ill conduct suban bone oba wo mu ade e ono wo kasa ofro wo tumi titi watem oba ono eyi ye no emfa ne ho kura ode ne pe na ekop ko eyi e rough off Enkremosum mra no onfa nya dwuma 
Oba on tie wo be ma no wasem no. Yeah. Admonish them first. O se o yere o nwa ma ne won in the first. To us next. O ma ne won in the first yeah. Next refuse to share the abet. Oh say or she said punishment no in order of importance. We say we mouth soft one. Oba no nwa dia ma ne strong warning. Yeah. Or to to a men ne na. Yeah. And last, and last, beat them lightly. Lightly, no one bracket him and can't arab no. Yeah, yeah. Omo the lightly no be share ho to justify some means. Yeah. The oh can Quran English. Who who be be one bracket him one and can. Yeah. Oya we. Enna me dey we malam ba akuna one ko ho Quran. The lightly no you need to train na kain. Yes. But if they obey you, masa brabak beat no ne hear me. Refuse to share their bets. We admonish them. Refuse to share their bed and beat them and beat them. Yeah. So also Obani Muadia man a warning. Second one, man in that third one, Bono. Hey, many anum Mesremo. Hey, so Abba and Mutia says, and Cremosuna, Mosum Wagana. So Mupa in Cremo for the ya, Munsia, Rabin Cremosonia, Namutia Groa. And yes, someone can Cremoni Basha Jens. Then in Cremonia, ya Rasta, no digna, Sachi. Dreadlocks. Tu do Arab memoir, you who are banned into verse no crap or banned into or ba and you see a wood abasa. Yeah. Tis a mother soon cremosuma. More revive, more revival. Nay, yet to set the original cremosum. Now a group in a moody and the Arab mem that son the Yirimusa washing at home. Hm. Common sense tells me. Mawale oba. Wofufua. Na waka benku. Na mawane. Yalai soup. Na baya nkati konto. Ube wansi makofa oba fofro. Wofufua. Menye antoa. Menye njia. Na matamu. Na midisika kakraka ho. Akosu ya mansa papa. Me baya boni biya ni. Me di odo. Eni ya hombrasi ya ne baye. Me banu wa mwume. Tintin the theatre, maybe Jan Quine, a busier for bomb a car, not the chia, bye bye transport. Yawa, nay, I shall dano. Beat her the end and ne in Cremonia ope. Tio Koran, na boy, you face the consequence of police station. Let's just say, and nipa cry, yes, 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 Quran no essay. Sir, who said the Nipa Baku? At the time, you will say the Yasin the Penina and Uku Nipa Baku. It is said he will cool here in the penny now. And Okrano, now what Talmud in him and a Koran you could tweet. Oh, yeah, Magiatum. The battle a your force said Obinian Cremoniana. A your shana. Oh, a your share. So this is me, Metizongoa, by me, Yank Cremoni, a by force. And Okoran, ah, there's war. Ah, or say there is no compulsion in religion. Oh, yeah. Koran chapter 9, verse 29. Verse way. Quran. Oh, say your friend, you be abrogation in the Quran. Yeah. Oh, you say your Quran verse be or what? Your Quran in Batanya Duma. Aye. Quran verse at the council. Meaning, Abraham ye reveal Quran no. Verse is be by ya. Ne ye mistake. Na another verse abe correcte no. How can the Creator make mistake? Meaning, why in Cremonian say that one? Mr. Sheikh, no answer. Abrogation. Your Quran. There's a verse, Biba. Only the another one, Biba. Yeah. Uh -huh. Correct, you know. The God I know will never make mistakes. Uh -huh. God is all knowing, omnipotent, uh -huh. omnipresent, omniscient. Uh -huh. thousand years. That is the problem with Christianity. Yeah. Old Testament, Kasa. We must see Jesus as a son. Old Testament, Kasa. We must see him. Any kind. 
Quran 9:29. Quran chapter 9 verse 29. Fight against those who believe not in Allah. Can I say fight against those who believe not in Allah. Fight against those who believe not in Allah. Yeah. Yeah, what Quran verses maybe about fight na. Eh for self defense. Yeah. Enemy ni bebere o. Ah, eh say 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 abosum so fa no attack mo a. Eh na mo so mo attack yo mo. Aha no or can you please say fight those who do not believe in Allah. Obi nji Allah to mo. Eh force. Ah na bi. So be nji Allah to mo a. O se bi anim. Eh no say ye nyina ye be wu na judgment day ya kwa kwa to ono Allah na na Allah aka say hey wo wan so me into come some jim. Nya nya ono be ka kire ne ma say obi nyi mi mi a ene ne nkoko. Ono nya nkoko ono nya ho de ana. Ni wo de on sin ba kwe. Ai. Kain or in the last day tie kain yum fight against those who believe not in Allah fight against those who believe not in Allah not in the last day o be on the judgment day indeed no forbid that which has been forbidden by Allah adia Allah si men ni no be this adia no is messenger muhammed any o be on the prophet muhammed into see any pano yeah. and then yeah. yeah. so and those who acknowledge not the religion of truth any o be on the religion of truth eh yeah, yeah, islam yeah and then unko why sa verse we ena omo a omo di nkremusum din e di bone no se enye sa na nkremu ne te ya en de shake be kire me mu enu no omo di di bone no wo ko ka pa no me ko tu ala se men ko ma no ai to be the bomb she no ho no me ko wura so de boom u bi sa na fight for allah there was another verse i actually say say who sacrifice o life na wu e de ma allah o be ko heaven No, 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 no. Life is so precious, sir. Oh. The giver of life will tell you to die for him. Hmm. Why did you create me in the first place if you want me to die? Who person me who are? Why did you give me the life? When to make catch the money now, sir? Yeah, yeah, book be a sir. Better than I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. And cross for me, go to me, sir. After I'm sick, yeah, yeah, book. When I catch now, yeah. Me say I don't need a book to tell me there is a creator and to teach me good morals. Me pa to me mfa wonyo ko mato. Me ma book en kan sa me ho. Na bi. Pa to e bra bible en e Quran en ma Africa no. Na ye nana no o mu nim se be ma no be ma e ye bone. Na mu nim. Na no kra no o ya e tu o kra be de. Ku na ye twa be. E ye Christo fo ta ka se bible ne ka se Mundi e di abano na mofa ahahan no ensa yade e nti ebra bible ma ye no na ye nana no nim se popo no ye di na na haban so ye fever edro na ye nim ye nim dada ye nim ya ye nim dada ti we ni de nti amerika che me se ye nya book me i don't need the quran to be a good person me me ya do ye me me wo yire ya me do me yire me hwe me ma me mokro no me nsisi o me mra de ye na ko on se san se Manje prophet Muhammad dem din tin nyankwa. Ah. Eya, mo bobo nkremofu oni din. Mo bobo na mo akobo Abraham. Ene eya na me wura akọ no. Se Abraham no ye nkremoni, Isaac o ye nkremoni, Noah o ye nkremoni. Sa prophet ye nkremofu a, bi bi some question. Ba cho na Quran aba. Da bi. Na prophet Muhammad aba. Da bi. E bi. Into if somebody was a Muslim without prophet Muhammad and Quran why do you tell me say i need the quran and the prophet Muhammad to become muslim hey. that's my argument to me damun na say adwena nya djuma but ne pray me ma say Masha Allah. Thank you for that wonderful and harmonious and fantastic presentation. Okay. The brother raised a lot of questions for Sheikh Jafar to answer. Where's the paper? Okay. Now rebuttals 
for only 20 minutes. In fact, I don't know whether we should go out and run more and come back so that everybody's okay. So Sheikh Jafar will start his rebuttal for only 20 minutes. Nam. Salam alaikum wa rahmatullah wa barakatuh. Masha Allah, you know, there is one thing that we need to know. What is the topic? Which religion, worship is accepted by God? So, what actually did our brother, what did he talk about? Are we talking of uh, the Quran? We are not to choose some verses, be to your wife, this. The question is which religion and worship is accepted by God. But when he came here, he was not able to even give one quotation or to just give a logical explanation to support his theory that this religion is accepted, this religion is not accepted. You know, if I were your teacher, your mechanical accuracy I will give you zero, the content of your expression zero, and your expression itself, everything, your organization, everything I will give you zero. Why? Because you have deviated from the topic. You are not treating the topic. The topic is which religion, worship is accepted by God. But, you know, just see where you've gone. Instead of you, you know, I asked your, your, your guy, one of your guys, and he said there are religions. So, which means you are contradicting what your guy said, right? Then the common sense here is not working. The common sense is not working. We are not here to talk of the issues of common sense. We are here to debate on the, this topic which religion and worship is accepted by God. Now, let me just go over. Because he has completely deviated from the topic. I suppose even not to go there. But I want to make things very clear to him. To make it very clear to him that although he has not treated the topic given, but yet he needs to be corrected with some one or two mistakes he has made using the Quran. Now, in the first one, you know, when he began, he said it's not necessary, he speaks key. But why didn't he allow his reader to read the key version of either the Bible or the Quran for him to explain? Here, it means the common sense here is very feeble. It doesn't work. Now, let's go to another thing again. He said, no one has heard God speaking. But why do you have to believe in him? No one, don't you believe in God? You've never heard God speaking, but you believe in Him. Why do you believe in Him? Tell me. You said God has never been seen by anyone, but you believe in Him. Yes. Since you believe in God, I'm asking, why do you have to believe in Him? Have you ever seen your soul before? You've never seen your soul before, but you believe you have soul in you. Why should it happen that? Having common sense told you that there is soul in you, but you cannot see it. Let us, let us continue. He says, if everyone claims that we should accept their religion, then, you know, he is asking that this people said we should accept their religion. This people said we should accept that. Now, I want just one quotation from all of those religious denominations where this man says we should accept this religion. I'm trying a challenge to you. You will either use the Bible, the New and the Old Testament to tell me, to tell me where this Bible is saying the Christian said we should believe in not their religion. But I have been able to quote from the Quran for you, making it very clear that Allah says anyone who seeks any other religion other than Islam, it will never be accepted of him. And in the day of judgment, that person is going to be among the losers. I have quoted you, so I want you to also come and quote me. That is the debate. I have quoted you, I've given you quotation, so I want you. You have said it. That this person said we should accept. So who are those people? And what are the things they said in their book? I will make sure I encounter all what you've said. Do you understand? I will... You got it right. Now, he is saying people are being forced into Islam. No one has ever been forced into Islam. Why? Because Allah said, he quoted, that there is no compulsion in Islam. No one is being forced. When you left Islam, who forced you back to Islam again? When you left Islam, who forced you back to Islam? 
No one, you know, let us not forget. We shouldn't let Avon Ben Moshe keep misguiding people. Why? Because the topic is what we need to treat. Don't leave the topic and then be using your brains instead of topic to be saying something which is not necessary. We are dealing with what? This topic. That the topic that you come treating, you've completely deviated 100% from it. The question is, which religion and worship is accepted by God? So you need to let us know which of those religions is accepted. But you came by taking this one, using this, taking this one, going where you're supposed to go, instead of treating the actual topic. So I am challenging him once again. When you come, I have been able to prove from the Quran, making very clear that the Quran said, you also quoted from the Quran. So I want you to record from the Quran where the Quran is saying Islam is not accepted by God. Where the Quran is saying this religion or that religion is also in addition accepted by God. Ah, look at the topic. Here is the topic. When you go for an examination and a topic is given to you, you will just write what you've done. You've completely deviated. So I'm drawing your attention once again. The topic is which religion and worship is accepted by God. We want to know which of them is accepted by God. And then, he raised another evidence, he raised another topic. That, uh, P. Black, let's read something here. Open to me Quran, Quran chapter 9, verses number 29. The mic. Quran 9, 29. Quran chapter 9, 29. Fight against those who believe not in Allah. Listen, this ayat, there is nothing without any reason. Because God cannot tell you, Adam, go and fight. Or I cannot tell you, Adam, go and beat this man for me. What is my motion behind telling you to go and beat him? Something happened during those days. The prophet made the peace of God be unto him. He sent one of his followers, one of his companions, with a letter to some people. So when they sent, when the letter was sent aggressively, they caught him, beat and killed him. So prophet didn't speak here. It was the Almighty God. He said, in return, those who are fighting you, prophet, those who are killing your people, make so sure whenever they come with an attack, make sure you defend it. So you need to also fight them back. That is how the thing happened. It happened on a purpose. But God cannot just tell you fight against those. Why did God bring the word? There is no compulsion in the Quran. There is no compulsion in religion. So the Almighty God didn't happen on a purpose. When the companion of the prophet was sent, I even supposed not to talk of this because we are not talking of uh, the issues in the Quran. We are not talking of uh, either the Quran is divine or something like that. You have deviated. You to accept. But if you don't accept you've deviated, then I want you to come back. When you come back, come and encounter. I've just given a lot of quotations. So when you come back, I want you to refute all of them. I want you to refute all of them. And besides also, he made mention that the Quran said we should beat our wives. Yes. Look, the Quran said that, but you know, there are measures, there is a reason, or there are reasons why the Almighty God said that. Now, Mr. Avram, right in a moment, when I sleep with your wife, what are you going to do to her? You'll kill her. You'll not divorce her. When I sleep, see, and what are you going to do to me? Let's take it for instance, in his room, in his own room, on his own matrimonial bed, he'll come and see me, Thinking up with his wife to be more honest, be more honest to yourself. What are you going to do? You will cut off my head. Yes. What are you going to do? When you cut someone having intercourse with your wife, what are you going to do? <laughs> Just be honest to yourselves. Eh? What are you going to do? You will complain. See, you will even kill the person. And then besides, he said, the Quran said. If someone sells, the hands of the person must be cut off. There are an amount of goods stolen, or it's supposed to be stolen before that law is what? Supposed to work. I cannot come and steal this water, and then you stand on it by, by saying you are coming to kill me. 
Let me tell you something. If you don't know history, go back to the history of China. When someone says they removed the kidney of that person, do you have that information? They removed the kidney of that person. So, whenever you steal, you cannot just steal this water and then they will just cut your hand. There is an amount of commodity that you will steal before such will happen. You get it? Before such will happen. So, Islam doesn't say we should beat our wife or our wives. But, you know, there are measures to it. First, when she becomes so arrogant on you, you need to advise her, you deny her your bed, and then also, you beat her. Now, the beating, which is being used here, I always say, if you don't have colloquial understanding, if your figurative level of her expression is very low, there are a lot of things that you will not understand in the Quran. You get it? So the Quran is not there for feeble-minded people. You get it right. The Quran is not there for feeble-minded people. And then he was saying, there are some words which are abrogated from the Quran. I want you to just give me one surah, which you think it was not good. And then they remove that surah and bring another surah in place of that. I want it. Which surah do you think is not good? Then they extend that surah with another one. I want to get it. I want to get it. Because the topic which is supposed to be discussed was not what has been disclosed. Yes, that is what I, I was asking. I want to know which surah cancels that surah. Yes, I want to know. And then, you give me the surah where the Quran is saying this is not good and therefore we are replacing this with that. That is what you wanted. Because when you go to law court, you must make so sure you give every bit of evidence of what you know about a particular case. You need to give evidence upon evidence. Do you get me right? Now, he quoted Quran chapter 6, verses number 152. Mr. P. Black, be fast and then. Quran 6. Yes. Verse 152. About before then, just get me Quran chapter 24, verses number 2. Please be quick for me. Quran 24. Quran chapter 24. Uh -huh. Quick, 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 quick. Let me have this Quran. Quran 24. Verse number, verse number 2. Verse number 2. Yes. It says what? Verse number 2. Yes. The fornicators. Yes. It says what? The fornicators. And the fornicator. Read, read, read quick. Flock each of them with a hundred stripes. Okay, now. It's saying. Those fornicators. We have it in our law. Even common sense will tell you that fornication is not good. Good. If common sense is even telling you um, for, uh, fornication is not good, what do they do to those people? During the olden days, when someone is caught, they banish that person from his country or from his town. They banish that person when someone fornicates. Yes, you need to go back to the olden history and read our cultural history and know the consequences of those who fornicate. But let me ask you something. And you are telling me that the Quran said should be that person. Now, if you have about 10 years old girl and someone raves your child, what are you going to do to that person? I want you to use your common sense to tell me. When someone rapes your child, what are you going to do to that person? Are you going to clap for that person that you've done well by raping my child? So, you know, you also need to apply your common sense before understanding what the Quran says. The topic is which religion and worship is accepted by God. I have treated the topic, but when you came, you were not able to do anything about it. And besides, I am giving you another chance. Maybe you could not understand the topic very well. So I am giving you another chance. The Quran says, if anyone believes in any other religion, rather than Islam, it will never be accepted of him. In the day of judgment, he shall be among the losers. I want you to give me only one chapter. Only one chapter, that is what I wanted from you. To just tell me, refute me with it, by telling me this is what your Bible or your Quran or your common sense logical book tells you. I repeat again, come and treat the topic. Don't go about by beating about a bush saying what does not pertain to the given topic. The topic is which religion and worship is accepted by God. I have been able, making it very clear, Islam is accepted by God. Come and tell me, Islam is not accepted by God by backing your theory with evidence from the Quran or any other book. I'm giving you another chance again. 
I am giving you another chance. Come and treat the topic. The topic must be treated. Don't leave the topic and go away. All what you are saying, cut your hands, do this, do that, and other things. It is not part of what we are treating. What we need to know is which top, uh, which religion. What we need to know is which religion. So Islam is the religion accepted by God. Come and give me reasons why you think Islam is not accepted. You are telling me, or you earlier on told me that this man says his religion is the best. This man. So I want you run after the order. You quote that these people said their religion is good and therefore good. This is what they said in their scripture. I repeat again. There is no scripture on the surface of this earth. I repeat for the second time. No scripture on the surface of this earth that you will see or that you can read the scripture saying this religion is accepted by God apart from what? The Quran. So I want you when you come back for the second time again come and base all your argument on the topic. That is what we are treating. We are not to, you know, the topic can be out of bounds. Get straight to the line. When we are to move a car, you don't move the car in rooms. We move it on the low road. So that says the topic. Come and tell me which religion and worship is accepted by God. But all what you are saying is not part of the debate. You are just saying your mind. And there is all the issues of a logical statement that must come from you. Everyone has it all. Uh, everyone has a common sense, including animals. Common sense has nothing to do with this. This is a pure religious topic that we need to treat. So I want you, I challenge you, come and tell me which religion and worship is accepted by God. All what you came saying, if I should be your teacher, I will give you zero over hundred. Because what? You have deviated from the topic. I challenge you to come and treat the topic when you come for your rebuttal. That's what I wanted from you. Thank you. Allah, the, the hall is heated. The hall, the hall is heated. Brother, are you ready for your rebuttal? Uh, 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 we are now in an age of trials and tribulations, and for that matter, we have different or world opinions as far as religion is concerned. But I, I, advise, I, I, I <clears throat> it's not easy. I'm trying to advise each and every one of us here to keep believing in what you have already believed in. Keep believing in what you have already believed in. My brother, are you ready? Inshallah. Yo, um, what is it? One more share, me debate be an debate be a no more see me deviate me me ni religion be em. What's it? Ah, how can I say? Oh, we best friend with debate, no, no, we need to pan the GD and South Friend debate, and I'm a one, yeah, yeah, brother Jafar, or tell me debate. Kobaya three years in it. Me catch and say, Onya de deno, Onya de deno, Onya send the moon in a moon. To be fed debate, Nam in Casano, I mean in the India. Me in your Christoni, Name the Bible, actually me jiddy. Me in your Hindu, Name the Hindu book, actually me jiddy. Yeah. Me in the say, we don't need religion. We need the brain again. My gate, let me say, Mammy and Fawa, yeah. My gate, let me say, Menu. Oh, Shaitan, it be anymore. Shaitan, oh, man, I'm going to be a yano. Oh, many religion and to one of each and Islam. Now they are Kasa. Mammy, you should make them in GDS or say, Yeah, yeah, religion. Now, I don't need even your Quran. Because of this, Onokra can say, mm. you have to stand and prove your point with the Quran. Yeah. That is what I did. Min diviyati. Mi ni o sun di em, mi si yusu wa adjen na fe bo bra. Nyan ku pon bo wo no. Eta nyan ku pon di adjen etu utrim. The level of thinking in do a mwade. Eti aboa, aboa, oba, ene natna. Aboa, onfre oba ne yane lai. En fane nkwa tina support. And Tom Mortal Man, and only a Banakoda. 
we share na popopopopo no ne nada dey ni pa na sense of reasoning and to be again and ya dey traffic light yeah say we twa car kwa mu a en guide o obi adwen and o dey create medicine obi adwen o dey create phone yeah they i don't need a book to tell me there is god ya na na no kra ka say obi entre abofra nyame yeah I say, me me say, religion be any ho. Now me say so say, me an kopo. They believe in God. They what believe? Are you fifty-fifty? I believe means I'm not sure. Yeah. We all believe there is a creator. We don't know. Nobody has seen the creator before. Uh, okay. Do you know Nanato is the president, or you believe he is the president? You know do, yeah. because he atu aba and na wini mo no. Then two can say, I believe. Is this your your phone? Now say, I believe it is mine. Hey, sorry, I can't say. Maybe in the medical world, who the drug be by? Now you say malaria drug. Now what? Malaria drug by ya? Who can cope with that? Ya, ko ye e ya ko ya say. I believe that this vaccine is for malaria. Nobody will take you serious. Who mm. can say? I know. I don't think that. Omo ye vaccine we ya. Come try on animals. Yeah. It is science that deals with proof and evidence. Mm. Religion deals with belief in quiet and so far. Mm. Beat your wife, no? No. Oh, chiremu. Beat your wife, no? Jafar explained accepting it, trying to dodge it, came back accept. Stay. Are you beating? Ah. Say, who got to wear it? Now, be mad and swear. Yeah, who be brave? Yeah, who be brave? Yeah, who be brave? Ah, yeah, who be brave? Ah, my ba, and my be brave, be good. We are see ya. Oba, I can not see. Oba, break the chin foot through the airport. Now, man, in your corner, I caught it. Yeah, me, you couldn't say. No need to kill. Who got to say? Be man, you but to so cry cry. And they declare evidence. And they all got to na na kwe you phone crow. They are quite a papa, and look right here. Say, and yes, no cross. I yaw mobile, you yan a quaint near the new brassias one. Tete no, yan ananum, not a big a break a man. The patcher, don't confuse fornication, adultery, and rape as no rape as no fornication and as no adultery. Yeah, adultery, a ya waffa, o benere, a ya adultery. Ena fornication in religion, aye enkrofo mi enua mo wale na muada. Ena rape, aye enukra ni ya kudau. Rape oba ano so ya kudau. Oya mamiyo, ufo suno na wone neda yefeni rape. Uyirimpo, odo wansa kano, no ase mabere. Na odo wansa kano, no ase mabere. Na wotoshe na tuwa aye rape. Inti ano na you were confusing yourself with rape. Uh, uh, adultery and fornication. There be now you can fornication say Quran say mon wale na moda a hundred beatings. Yeah. Now to there be and yes, auntie. So on. Ena can in san na I say the amount of idea. I don't know one can the amount of idea we are speaking on san. And you cut the hand. Quran can say when somebody still something light. Beat him and something big cut the hand. I say, "Kurong fu anu muncha nsa." Timesrao, kurono ena ope habit ede abakia na we kuto habit no. Na me muati asia say me kurong verse a me kuto yara. I know the habit. Yeah. Whether it was revealed in Mecca, whether it was revealed in Medina, ede kurono amba one day. Kurono ba a period of twenty three years. And to Prophet Muhammad peace be unto him. You beside the question, a wa or the man answer, not say both for naba. Then you will fall into a trance or solia. Now we are answer. Now you are throw. Any more Quran about gradual, you know. Twenty three years and the waraka a we a pair. That's the end of the Quran. I see there is no abrogated verses. Or China, not prepare abrogated verses in that yaba. But the verse for abrogation, you know, in the Quran chapter two. Ayat 106. Hey, 
wo yen kremo ni wo nim abrogation in the quran and the jain kremo som quran of the two yeah wo quran verse ya e wo quran another verse ba na be cancel any above one e kasa quran 2 Quran verse 106 106 then 106 eh uh-huh. whatever a verse t Quran no say enya prophet mabed na e chroy magiatum na ye both one e buy ana meboa god still both one e buy no prophet mabed kai na ne 42 scribes e chroy scribes on the na e chroy no mo chra o kasa te say both one na e kasa ai say mo asole awoyo awo yo na bofo na ba eye mi peter na me kasa no se ye ya mansa e na etina ba kasa no ka no ye kasa ya mansa na se peter ye se obofo peter na e kasa ta na quran na te omo omo de verses ne ba no muntie kan what ever a verse do we abrogate o se what ever a verse we abrogate or cause to be forgotten or cause prophet muhammad to forget na e chese ye wo verse sri bo ha e ya na prophet ni wure ya den ni wure fi no to make asa ye bisa na no so on kai enti answer ni brechi na kai me nyo he 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 say we suya the history behind the writing of the quran won he wo be kunto ko hunu e bi na ye bra ni e pie no islam o religion no fetu o mama fu kwen na ye ntata wo question e bi bi atwe mu ko na nka kuma si kromu a de amiye untu menye wo kromu ha hwe but e wi ase akɔ nanim e me hu se edu ba bi a ye ma kwen na wo bi so nkasa na ye ntie with all due respect kan he whatever advice do we abrogate whatever advice we abrogate of course to be forgotten or abrogate the meaning of abrogate no bi ntie people are famous Hey, what you you will buy out is a Quran and a prophet Muhammad and a Salah and a Komeka. What can I say? No, 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 no one to be in China and defend the Christo Sumwa. Or be a one jin di Kran who fasso chao. Yeah. Tia de Amecano. Tin cremo na munim Koran verses. And sia Koran. No munam in cremo sumu ka kenam zongo na dia agro awudi. Mm. Uh abrogate. Abrogate. To repeal. To repel. To repel. And yeah, crum kasa. Eh, what's the crum fayo? Why? It's not our mat tank. Yeah, miss. Me eme the class and make up brofo. No wa catch em cement. Yes. Yeah. Since make a tree casa, no one bones him. Be black. Kind of only abrogate, abrogate to repel, to repel, eh? Repel, eh? Uh-huh. Cancel, cancel. Yeah. Repel or cancel. Now go can't Quran verse no tree. Yeah. The verse is be umu ya cancel. They have run from my metre. What na? Me mo abrogated verses. We yem besha. Unsi ya diye wey. Every religion in Ghana. Must go through me to become truth. Yeah. Religion be will pass through me for a test. Oh yeah. <laughs> Can Quran two verse one oh six. Quran chapter two. Me me. I wasn't a Muslim, but I learned the Quran like I will be beaten. Me. Salam Rishi Bible no. Me share them na me share Quran na. But we say maabi ni aduma. Me share na ako cheke hadith. Na ma cheke baby ayi reveal it. And me ya debate be first. Me call two contradiction be. Me koye resem se no se enya contradiction. Yeah. Wo se en crofon in kremo for ye debate ya. Ye wo Quran verse ya. Wo se Yakobon wa anfa she enebo nipa. Quran verse ba ko se se or the cloth of blood enebo nipa. En na Quran verse ba ko so se or the dust enebo nipa. Wo ba gbe se ye contradiction. There be. Wo su ya sura no na wo hu de enti a e ba ya wo beti ase. De o se ye anfa she ambo nipa no. Or as police say, dot ye a ye she a dear bia and for swoon and ye de bonipa. Yeah. And a Quran verse no say, ye the cloth of blood and the bonipano. And ye Adam a sem no worker. Yeah. Mum said ye nipa a form me way for no more. And a Quran verse na or say ye the dot ye and the bonipano. Or refer to why Adam a ye contradiction. You need understanding. Mr. Ramo, say sir. Why? People are kind of
Can't he abrogate and you cancel it? Yeah. Whatever a verse do we abrogate? Whatever a verse we cancel. To us, or cause to be forgotten. Or cause to be forgotten. We bring a better one. We bring a better one. Yeah. Let's say Quran, a verse be over. You cancel. If you have a buy and a prophet Muhammad, you will see. And you will see. I 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 for good or for bad, religious people will remember me one yeah, day. Yeah. Will say me man how name me for so or someone ya we go to mono. This a question. Many a anu ye. Timi ni a jafaro. Men divieti. Me ni o sumbi em. Me ba ya na miye ji uniya and kame kotu Torah and the Talmud. Me ba ya na miye Christonia. Me kotu New Testament. Me ba ya na miye em Budenia. Me me kotu books ya ka. Timi srao. Sa me share Christo niya, me dene Bible na ana, me di disprovo no. Me share wun kere mwone no. Me chra wuse, a gwe yon e yon 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 Na verses bi o koran ni mukura na. Mi bise bisa question, ya de cheke no, en kwe yi. Ti me damu yon asi me di besi ya. A gwe yon a nye juma. Bo de pre. Ti me damu asi. Alhamdulillah. Eh, I want to believe that this is a debate but not a confrontation and for that matter be gentle enough we will entertain only and only 10 questions five for brother avram and five for brother jafar but please be gentle enough and comport yourself and ask your question reasonably So those who have questions for Brother Jafar, and you should not forget that is a question. And if you have a question to ask, that you come here because of the cameras. <clears throat> uh, no, because of the camera. Actually, you have to exercise more patience. We still have a cross examination, and that one is only 20 minutes in all, 10, 10 minutes each. So please let us give them the opportunity to cross exam examine themselves. So, brother, we start with the first speaker, brother Jaffa. Now, Salam alaikum. Now, Mr. Abram. Yeah. Um, can you kindly tell me the topic of discussion? What is the topic of discussion? <coughs> Which religion and worship is accepted by God? And what is the meaning of that language day? Uh, I think I've already explained to you that. No, I want to know. I'm now asking, not already. Uh, you see, before you call me for debate, you knew my belief system. You know I don't belong to any religion. I said, do what, I belong to what? I want to know what is the meaning of them. That is all. I'm asking you. No, no, no. no. Before you call me for you there see, is, let, there is, let us not. You do, are not. I'm coming. Let mm. us not do anything mm -hmm. that will sound as if we don't know each other before meeting. Now I know, but you know, on the field of business, there is no friend. Uh, I'm not but saying I want be my friend. I want to know what does it mean. Do that is the only thing I want to know. Which religion and worship and worship is, is accepted by God? What is the meaning? There are a lot of religion in the world. So and which one of them is accepted by God? So which is accepted? None of them is accepted. None of them is accepted. And I told you now. I'm com I'm coming. You I'm examining you and then I have to give you a putting into my time. I have to give you answer. No, I'm examining you and you are but you know that 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 is not in a professional okay, way, please continue. with all due respect. Okay. You said there are a lot of religions and the topic is saying which of them is accepted. Yeah. So which? None of them is accepted. None of them is accepted. I believe I'm coming. You said none of them is accepted. And you know so I can you and you know I don't believe in any of them. Yes, you don't believe in any of them. So would you 
say something about what you disbelieve or will you eat what you think is poisonous that you think will harm your life yes or no pardon me if something is poisonous yeah you know when you eat this thing it's going to harm your life are you going to eat that thing or you'll not eat it oh common sense tells me i shouldn't eat it so, so it isn't that common or doesn't that common sense tell you that if that thing is not good and you're therefore not going to eat it doesn't it tell you that if someone questions you on this and you say no doesn't common sense tell you to bring an evidence a supportive evidence to back up your claims of what you've said perfect and i did that today you did that today I've, so I've, i'm coming which of the, which which surah did you mention or did you let mr p black read sorry read that says islam is not accepted because i have given you quotations upon quotations saying islam is accepted so which is yours so i i did everything in the submission i told you i belong to common sense family we are free thinkers so come in mm -hmm. we use reasoning and logic in our so life if you use reasoning and logic why should you go into the quran which you believe is you know the quran is a, a religious book for some people if you use reasoning and logic why don't you go by only reasoning and logic by rather putting in into a scripture which belongs to a religion that you say or that you said is not good for you i quoted the religious material of you the one i am debating and then, you proved mm -hmm. your religion yes is true mm -hmm. because of the quran mm -hmm. and i told you me as a free thinker have checked certain things in the quran that tells me that even if there is god god will not tell us this and then and then those quotations that you mentioned from the quran has any of them supported what you said that islam is not accepted by god uh, yes or no whatever we no, no no i want to know you know simple answer demand a uh, simple question demands let me, simple answer let me, you know i'm always asking this question you know i just needed yes no yes no oh, no no that's not how we answer questions that's not we answer questions it's like you you've been to court and they ask you let's let are you that there is no there is no I'm time to quick um, i'm i won't ask you any question i'll give you my time for you to keep asking me i won't ask you any question you see it's like you are in court and they are asking you are you the thief they said let me explain they say hey shut up give us yes or no they said let me explain now but, according to according to your perception yeah according to your perception why did god create human being and genies why were they created i do because i, I don't believe, i don't believe in the concept of genes you don't believe in the concept of you genie. haven't seen one uh, before do you know jenny eh? do you know they are jenny they are they, they are not they are between angels and humans they, they are, are not yeah so do you why were they created uh, i don't believe in that concept it's, it's, in, the, it's in your belief system okay okay Even Chris, yes. i'm coming if, if i'm coming if, no problem I'm, I, I will give you no problem. problem i will ask any question no 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 ask because this is cross-examination i don't have anything to cross-examine you <laughs> so should i <laughs> uh, so give okay. me time to him he said he said he said he cannot cross his on me uh, I've, I've, whatever i should do i did it in the real battle so i have nothing to ask him so my 10 minutes is for him again him again that's 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 why when he speaks then he allow me to explain so that it will be it will flow so have i been dashed have i been dashed the, the 10 minutes yeah 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 for free. 10 minutes for free now i want to know from you mr abram if no religion is accepted by you why do you have to use those unaccepted religious scriptures to defend yourself i don't perfect i told you one mm -hmm. i disprove every belief system based on its book yeah. when i see a snake in your room mm -hmm. and i want to prove to everybody that there is a snake in that room i don't have to use another person's room i have to use your own room to prove the snake in the room so which, i'm coming mm -hmm. i'm coming so i disprove belief system based on their own book and prove my logic and reasoning from your own book do you know why i told you no religion is the truth but there is truth in every religion so, so then, before i started i quoted a surah that i told you is perfect 
and make sense. It is only a wise person who will accept the truth wherever it comes from. Now, because you know all the questions being asked, you are just just circulating without giving an actual answer to it. Now, I want to find out. You said the Quran is abrogated. Some verses. Some verses. Now, I want you to give me some of those verses and let me know the reason why those verses was revealed. I, I'll bring all those no, verses. We are doing... I, I, I gave you the verse. I'm respecting. I gave you the, the, the verse commanding abrogation. Mm -hmm. I didn't prepare those verses. No, no, no. Listen. My, the question... Sir, we are, we are, sir, sir, with all due respect, all right? I can ask you a question now. You can tell me you didn't prepare on that. You will bring me those verses tomorrow. Why should I... I excuse me. Why should I answer a question or why should I say a thing that I'm not prepared? I about? gave you a verse that will confirm an abrogation. And I said tomorrow, I give you a verse, and the abrogated verse, and the verse to replace it. I promise I will give them tomorrow. Why not today rather? T tomorrow, tomorrow. Is, tomorrow is the day we are treating why the Quran is not divine. Sure. And, and, all, those things, and all those things I'm on point to prove is not divine. Do you believe in Adam? Do you believe Adam existed? Uh, believing Adam existed? No. Um, let me explain. Okay. It's like, believing me, believe, um, asking me whether I believe in unicorns. Unicorns. Those horses with horns unicorn. 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 I, I saw them in a the movie. I've not seen one before. No. So, believing in Adam won't change anything. No, I want to know. Either, either you believe he has ever existed or not. No, no, I believe all those characters were, were frictional characters. Were frictional characters. Yeah, yeah. Even were, the Jews, mm -hmm. the Jews, the inventors of the Torah, uh -huh. says the story in Genesis, Adam, Noah. What is friction? What friction. is frictional? Yeah. Oh, frictional is like uh, something like Spider-Man. <laughs> okay, now, do you know, do you know if you said frictional, <laughs> Mr. Abraham, if you say frictional, <laughs> then it's a thing that has not, you know, that can be seen or you no, know no, it no. is just through imagination. No, no, no. All right. Okay. Frictional is like mm -hmm. frictional is like somebody's imagination. 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 But do you know created? Do you know, do you know we have? Do you know we have the tomb of uh, Adam in Sri Lanka? Uh, the tomb of Adam. But I didn't go and see Adam there. But oh, okay. I'm coming. Do you believe in history? I'm coming. Uh -uh. I'm coming. Mm -hmm. It's like somebody just called you mm -hmm. and told you this is the tomb of Adam. Yeah. The one telling you this is the tomb of Adam wasn't an eyewitness. So he wasn't an eyewitness. <laughs> but one thing is, do you believe in history? Does history lie? Uh, history can lie. History can lie. History can lie. Which, which history have you so far considered lying before? Uh, the Bible histories and the, the, the Quran histories. The, okay, which Quranic history are you talking about? Ah, please let me let me land with my last question. Brother, it's, it's time, it's time, it's time. <laughs> Thank you very much. May Allah bless both of you, inshallah. Brothers and sisters, as I have already told you, please. The floor is now all yours, and we will entertain only ten questions. Five for Brother Avram and five for Mr. Jafar. Those who have questions for Brother Avram should line up here. Only five people. Uh -huh. Mr. Akrugu is first because he raised his hands. It's okay. That's all. That's all. It's five. One, two, three, four, five. Brother, you will not get, uh, you not have the opportunity. And those who have questions for Sir Jafar, five. One, two, three, four. The last person. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. That's all. Okay. So, first question to First question to. Uh -huh. okay. The first question goes to uh, Brother Avram. The first question goes to Brother Avram. Please, if you come, mention your name and probably your organization. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Akrugu Idrisi Yakobu. I am the president and founder of Daybreak, the Hour and Development Center. Please, less noise, less noise, less noise. 
My name is Akurugu Idrisi Yakobo. I am the president and founder of Daybreak Dawa and Development Center. Um, I wouldn't have asked this question if uh, Brother Abraham have, uh, has admitted to us that he is an atheist. But since he says he believes in an almighty God's existence, it's compelled me to ask that question. And the question is, if God, if he believes God exists, and he believes God is the reason for our existence, what is the purpose behind our existence? Why were we created? That God created us to just come and be suffering like this without any purpose? I would want him to give me a convincing answer on that. It's very uh, mind-boggling. Yeah. Um, questioning, and I say, some can say, there ya, and confront him, I say, I accept there is a creator, but I'm not religious. There are people who say, God never existed, so they are not religious. Mine is different in this way. Telling you, there is no creator. It makes me look a bit foolish. Because once there is a creator, there must be a creation. Imagine I give you a magazine. Magazine are pictures, any flowers. Now my catcher will say, magazine way, and you will be here, yeah. It doesn't make sense. Even magazine with pictures, it will still be in here. Now questioning now, then what is the purpose of life? Then thing you will be here. The immediate thing, the creator that created everything didn't create everything 100%. He left a part in creation for man to perfect it. Tianku probo ni pano wama ya tadi wama ya mpabwa wanya ka akwai nyanku pembi ejuma. Some question, some questions demand much explanation. So it's like telling me not to answer the question well. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So nature, nature, which you call God in its own sense, gave every human being a unique gift. Somebody have the gift of a carpentry. Somebody have the gift of an artist. Somebody have the gift of engineering. So we are here to make the world a better place and to serve ourselves. Service to mankind is service to the Creator. Simple as that. Inshallah. Good evening to you all. Uh, my name is Sousu. I saw this program online and I did, I'm in Kumasi here. I saw this uh, program online and decided to come and listen to what you've all got to say about this. And I'm very, very confused this evening because Avram quoted Brother Avram or Mr. Avram. He quoted a verse in the Quran saying something like God chooses who he wants to choose and let go astray who he wants to go astray. So, I, don't, I want to um, shake to either confirm or deny that in the, in the Quran. If he, I'm, I'm coming, I'm not done. If he denies that, then I'm okay. But if he confirms, then I have this question. The moment I, I, I saw that, the moment I saw that, uh, the moment I saw that, I went online to check the number of Christians Muslims and those of the other religions on this planet. And between even Christians and Muslims, I saw that Christians outweigh Muslims about more than one billion time, like one billion people. Forgetting about the other religions. Meaning Muslims to Christians will be about 30% to 70 or something like that. I'm not very sure. I stand to be corrected. So my question now is did God set man to fail? Because Let's say all Muslims are the chosen ones. And all the other religions are those, are those who are not to be saved. And so, my question is, did God tell us, or did God set us up to fail or what? Because I'm a Christian. I was born into Christianity. Your no. question is, is, is okay. Right. Uh, you mean 
the Almighty Lord guides those whom He wills and misguides those whom He wills. Isn't it? Very good. So you're asking, either God, Almighty God, uh, either the Almighty God considers people and leaves others, isn't it? Yeah, because you confused yourself during your question. You need to be specific by asking an actual question that this is my question. Yeah. Now, if you like, you ask one, I answer it. My question is, uh -huh. other, the other religions too, um, with respect to um, Muslims, mm -hmm. it's about 30% Muslim, Muslims on this planet, mm -hmm. and all the others are Christians, or other religions. So why did God choose to have lesser people to save more than those? No, why did God choose less people to save more than the others? That's my question. I don't know whether you understand my question. Mm. You see, um, simple as that. Allah says in the Quran, He guides whomsoever He wills, yeah. and leads those the and then lead those. To go astray. Go astray. That's yeah. just the, the question. Oh, that that I'm coming. Listen, listen, listen. So he's trying to tell you that he went to the net and checked the percentage of Muslims as compared to Christians. Other religions. And the other religions. And Muslims are only thirty percent. Yeah. Does it mean that God has failed by leading majority yeah. to go astray. astray? That's the question. Why why did God, who is all knowing, not choose majority to be his, but rather in the minority. Now, that is why the Quran explains that there is no compulsion in what? In religion. Are you getting me? There is no compulsion in what? In religion. We don't force someone to become a Muslim. We don't force anybody to become what? To become a Muslim. So, you know, the Quran is making it very clear to us. Whenever the Almighty God opens your heart to the truth, then you follow Islam, his religion. But whenever your heart is restrained, then you go astray by what? Diverting, doing something else. So, those who are in the religion of Islam, their hearts, their breasts are opened in order to do what? In order to accept it. But yet, the truth are always being told by just that it is humankind who doesn't want to accept and work with the truth. Let's take it for instance, I have cited so many examples, making it very clear that the Quran says, Islam is the only accepted religion by God. It has been said. So if you like, you follow. If you like, you leave. So those who have followed it are the people who have known the truth. As the Quran said, I challenged him, but he was not able to do what? He was not able to meet my challenge. That no scripture, no scripture made mention that this religion is accepted, this religion is accepted, this religion is accepted. That is why God said, no compulsion in religion. We don't force someone to be a Muslim. And then secondly also, you said, I'm correcting you. You said the percentage of Muslims is like 30%. Which is a lie. Correct. Okay, okay. If you stand to be corrected, then I'm correcting you. It's never true. The percentage of Muslims are more than that 30% that you're talking about. Which is, uh, which is approximately 45% plus. Which is approximately 45% plus. So Islam, there is no compulsion in it. So those who are guided are those who are knowing the truth coming into Islam. And those who are misguided are those who are turning back onto the Almighty God. At least, please, you try to use at least four to five minutes in answering the questions because the time is at premium. And, you know, tomorrow some Muslims, Muslims will wake will fast. Okay, thank you very much. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Yeah, I believe the program is getting much fascinating. Fascinating. But uh, Mr. Avram, this question goes to you. 
actually you did mention the fact that yeah you did mention the fact that you believe in what you see you don't believe there is religion that is one you don't believe there is religion or religion is known to I, I my belief is all religion yeah. were invented by men by men but the creator is not religious they didn't give us any so the you creator think? is not muslim it's not a hindu it's not a christian yeah so what i want to say at this point is that every aspect of your conception is also a belief to even believe in the fact that the creator you now you are imagining the creator you yourself have not seen creator but you are telling us that you only believe in what you see but you have not seen creator you are calling him nature or energy whatsoever we will yeah. concede that that is one and two to also talk about oh, no, things no he's expressing his building point around the question yeah yeah so what i want to to tell you is that if you only believe in what so you yours, see, yours is not a question right mine is a question right but i said you want to tell me yeah I'm putting it this way okay. so that you'll be able to answer me like okay. very well. Okay. You believe in what you see. Right now you are using a mobile phone. Yeah. The same phone without any addition or subtraction, it tells you you have credit, you don't have credit. Oh yeah. And you believe in that you are using it for communication. Excellent. You call somebody somewhere, you don't see the link of communication out, it went through. But you believe. Yeah. You believe you have dreams. Sometimes some people just do sacri, you they do charming, you see it, you believe, but it is unimaginable. So how do you explain this? Oh, excellent. Now, now, hold the phone. The question of me holding the phone. You didn't ask the question well. I don't need the manufacturer. I don't need to know the manufacturer before I know how to use the phone. Me not having credit is not a matter of belief. It's a matter of knowing. I know I don't have credit. I don't believe I don't have credit. Believe comes when there is no evidence. Okay, so, thank you. Let me help you. Just prove you say you. You know, in science. Character. Let me let's put rel the difference between okay. religion and science. We have two types of science. We have spec speculative science and proven science. Speculative science is like the age of the world. Some say 7 billion, some say 28 is speculative. But to prove, to prove um, the Archimedes, Archimedes principle, there will be practical for you to know. So science deals with practicals and proof to know, believe in God has nothing to do with religion. That's what I told you. I don't need to know the manufacturer of the phone before I buy it. I've seen a phone. Then I've gone. I want to know the one who invented the phone before I use it. Does it make sense? Once there is phone means there is a manufacturer. I don't need to know. All that I need is the function of the phone. That's why human beings don't need the creator. All we need is our purpose in creation. When there is a plant, the plant doesn't need the creator anymore. All that the plant, whether purple or mango, needs is to perform the function of a mango tree. During mango season, we are to see mangoes. When there is no mangoes, we will sit beneath it and play draft. Simple as that. So human beings must perform our function in creation. That's why even in your concept of judgment day, God will not judge us by what we believe, but how we dealt with our fellow human beings. Please, please, please. Let, my, last words. Last words. Some, I'm trying to tell you that what you, are, you, what, what you are doing is to try to use some sort of digression or intuition to, to like convince us. You are not still convincing us because the fact that... Maybe I'm not convincing you, you enough. No, 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 no. The fact that you yourself, you don't have proof to even back that. To back there what? Is, that there is a creator. That's you why, just also have a that, no, that concept that's why as I, we believe that's why concept. I told you example is this the first day you landed on the moon you saw a coca-cola bottle that should automatically tell you somebody has been here before you thank you i'm coming you don't need to see the one who drank the coke seeing the coca-cola bottle alone tells you oh, okay. 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 i'm telling you i am alive once i am a creation there must be a creator. I've not seen before. Okay, okay. I've not heard it. Please, please don't don't waste my last words. If you believe there is a creator and that creator have been able to produce all things within us, please last thing. 
What, 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 what I'm trying to say is that if you believe there is creator, well, why finish. don't you also you believe see, that? I'm coming. Sometimes, eh, sometimes somebody's question might do a greater good even than the debate. If we, we um, understand, we came all the way from Accra just because of the, even if we will spend the whole night here for our salvation, I think it makes more sense. So let, let him land and then let, let him go. Sometimes cutting people off. Maybe he won't meet again, maybe anywhere. So let him go. He has even finished. So my last thing, my last verse is that if you believe there is creator, though you don't need to see the creator, but because of his things he has made visible, you believe. Why don't you also hold the same belief that that same creator has also guided or inspired mind to also lead to salvation? You believe in the creator, but you are desisting yourself from the belief that that creator has been. Excellent. Has been to... That's why. We will, I will prove the reason why I don't believe the revelation of the Quran and Prophet Muhammad tomorrow. Because the Quran says, if I see any contradiction in it, I should reject it. So, thank you. Sir Jafar, I'll make this question simple. Alright. My name is Bafo. So, um, when, during the Rebata, you said you need to see beliefs and proofs. The, my question is very simple. I believe you've not seen God before, Allah before. So how do you know that Islamic is the accepted religion by Allah? Well, that is a very great question. I have never seen God before. And similarly to, you've also not seen God before. But I believe in God. You also believe in God, isn't it? Oh, no. I'm coming to answer your question. No, you, you're supposed to be back so that after the question you go and sit down. Now, I want, to, I want you to make your question known again. Exactly what you asked. You wanted proofs. Yes. So I want you to prove to me mm -hmm. how you know. Because I believe you've not seen God before. Yes. Nobody has seen God before. So how do you know Islamic is accepted by Allah? Good. It's the only religion accepted by Allah. Very good. Now, that is why I quoted from the Quran. So the Quran made it known, made it very clear to me and to those who are reading that it's only Islam that is accepted by God. Now, I'm coming. Let me quote you. Oh, do you have any observation? No, I, I just mean, want to go. Because you said you, you wanted beliefs and proofs. I'm coming to answer you. You said, why do I know? And I believe the book was written by man. By man? Yeah. Okay, I'm coming. It's not written by Allah. Alright, don't worry. Let's just pause it there. First, I will give you a quotation showing that it's only Islam that is accepted by God. Now, when we get to Quran, chapter 5, verses number 3, listen. Allah says, this day I have perfected your religion for you. I have perfected your religion for you, considered my favors unto you, and have named you Muslims. This especially means we Muslims, the name on us, or the religion Islam itself. No, it says this, this, I have perfected your religion for you, completed my favor upon you, and have chosen for you Islam to be your religion. So here, Quran is making it very clear. That what? Quran is making it very clear that the religion of Islam itself came from the Almighty God. And secondly, Secondly, you said it's a human who wrote the Quran. Yeah. Okay. Please, let me answer that and also ask you a question back. The Quran, when we get to... Please, I'm coming. You've asked the question and I'm explaining. I've given you quotation, right? Showing Islam came straight away from the Almighty God. But you don't have anything to back. Or you don't have anything to refute what I've given you. What and secondly... Is, no, you're not getting my point. What I'm saying is, we need proof. Just like you told Avram, you need proof and evidence. Yes. We are dealing with proof and evidence. Mm -hmm. So can you prove to me that God, Allah, Allah is saying that the Islamic is accepted by, ah, it's the only religion accepted by. Okay, let me, let me give you proof. Um, people, are, please, let's read this question. Let's um, read for me Quran chapter 385. Quran chapter 3, verses number 85. It says what? I'm coming to give you the proof you asked. Please, I'm coming. I'm, you asked for a proof. 
Do you understand? And where do you bring our proofs? We bring our proofs from what is written. So let us see. Quran 385. 385. Now listen to the answer of the question you've asked. It says what? And whosoever seeks a religion other than Islam. Allah said, whoever seeks other religion or any religion other than Islam, it will never be accepted of that religion will never ever be accepted of that person. And in the hereafter, and in the day of the judgment, he will be one of that religion. person will be among the losers. So here, Quran 385 is answering the question you asked. You need evidence. That is the first evidence. But if you still don't understand, if you want me to add another evidence, ah, this is the brother, proof. Brother, 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 your give, question give is answered. The back. I bet you go and sit down. Your question is answered. No, no, please, I'm coming. Wait. You know, let him, let him, let him get a mic. Brother. Your action of the proof. Brother. Brother, come back. Your action of the proof indicating Islam is accepted. Yes, you've asked of the proof. I'm coming home. Listen. And then we're speaking. I'm also speaking to the whole world. He asked me to give him a proof showing that Islam is accepted by God. My question and then was, I gave you the proof. My question was, you've not seen God before. Yes. And you said Islamic is the only religion accepted by Allah. Accepted by that Allah. Means God. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So what is the proof to give to us that Allah has accepted it? That, that, is, that is the proof. We don't need a book. No, no, no. Ah, no. Excuse me. Do you really, do you really understand my grammar? No. Ah, you've asked for a proof. Brother Jafar. Brother Jafar. Brother Jafar. Inshallah. Please. 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 <laughs> I'm coming, I'm coming. Please, brother, 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 I beg you. You see, let's, let's not try to be so emotional. Please, brother, brother. The question was simple. And you were simply answered. That's all. He's a Muslim and he proved from the Quran. So when you ask him, I'm coming, you talk. The question you asked. He gave you a perfect answer. He is a Muslim. And you are asking him to prove you where Allah says um, um, Islam is religion. It's his religion. And he is proving it from his source of proof, which is the Quran. You didn't ask him, aside the Quran, he should prove. Uh, so he gave you a perfect answer. No. So you were demanding an answer outside the Quran, but you didn't ask the question that way. So he, he, he gave you an answer. Next, next question. Moshe, Pacho Moshe, Uji Uji history AD. Um, it's a history day. Uh, okay, sir, about... Okay, sir, about... Okay, sir, about Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Yeah. Oni waraka bin naufa. Yeah. Osi waraka bin naufa na echire no versus no. And since waraka bin naufa. I know you're know. Jew, no. No, you uh -huh. do man those information. What I can be now for so any prophet Muhammad Shia three years time in Uye. Once we say the Quran neba twenty three years. Yeah. So asama ukano, which is which? Asana me me question number two. No. Shit. Don't say. Ena number two. Say unim Jimmy for a two out of one. Only one question. Uh, oh, say. Oh, no, 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 the question he asked was, the brother made us known that it was Nafal who was teaching Prophet Muhammad the verses of the Quran. 
And when he met him, it was only three years when Naufal died. But the, the brother, the same brother made it known that the Quran was revealed within the period of 23 years. So that there, there is a, a kind of contradictory statement in that. So that you should clear it for us. To, to, to understand this, you, know, you have to know the relationship between Khadija or Do you know the Khadija? Uh, no, 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 no. Obi Okro ni. Eh eh. And there is a relationship. There is there is a. What was that? To see. That's why. You, uh huh. That is why. This is why during my debate, I don't bring history. For Islam to be authentic, I'm coming. We believe in history. We don't know even if they were true. What must say? That's what during debate. Me to me confer Prophet Muhammad in a personal life in history. So during debate, we base everything on the one you believe to be divine. So I can make the relationship between. I am saying, "Baby, why you cross us? Oko wale kadija, you know, I problem." But when person people are debating him, well, uh, uh, to, to me, to me, it's a problem. Uh -huh. uh, next, next question. Please, 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 please. If your question is not answered, oh, listen, listen, listen. Please, maybe, the, maybe he's not prepared for the. Oh, if your question is not answered, please. We take it. Tomorrow is another day. Brother, listen. I beg you. I beg you, please. Duba Kuji. Sebo the Allah Kuji. Sebo the Allah Kuji. Can I join our side? Sebo the Allah Kuji. Duba. What else can let you buy in Ghana? Sebo the Allah. Munzoni. Mukoyabu. Ba Munzo Muifadaba. Kuma. Wallah, the debate has been successful. It's just left with some few minutes. Muje mu kwanta gobe. Gobe ni ma debate. Is the Quran divine? Question and answers. Kunu kuna ayin hakan na. Gobe ba mo alao. Kuk ask questions. So, kuk take your time. You take your time and then you listen to the speakers. Your voice, your voice. Yeah, what? Efrem ahen ba ma kutu fo me temen shia me pacho me pese me busa maram se yi e ben na quran e ba africa ana gana na se eno na yakopon nim se e muslim se man wa o mede be ko heaven dia aden wan fa ma bi ko quran e ba gana na africa no na generation bi abako nti din tin wan fa ama o mo mudi kan ba e no come again with your question pacho me se uh is the Quran a manual? I a debate a co heaven because we be a who could free Quran mu and I would the Quran name my who say a Muslim and a accepted by God. Yes, in the person who says a Quran so by no not generation be a bako in the other and young upon him say and I allowed him say no na a manual. I a debate con and change ya. I don't want farmer generation a deep kind or more with one farmer we are say in fifty years. Very good. Uh, we need to know every generation with what they are given. Some generation came, they were given the Torah, which we believe. The Quran has made mention of it. Some generation also came, they were given the Injil, that is the gospel, which we believe in. Some generation came, they were given the Zabur, that is the book of Psalms, which we believe. And this last generation were also given the Quran. And this Quran, you were asking of the date. The Quran was revealed 22nd December. That was first. You know, 602, uh, 609 CE. You understand? The Quran was revealed 22nd December 609 CE. Do you understand? So, this is the last generation which the Quran was given to. So, this generation came, they came with their book, or the Almighty God revealed that thing to them. But there is one thing. 
no one wrote the Quran. The Quran, no one wrote it. The Injil was not written. The Zabur was not written. And the Torah was also not written. They were all revealed. Do you get it? So when the Quran came in the year 609, that was the time of the Prophet. Do you know? Do you understand? So since the time of the Prophet, up to is also one generation. Do you get it? It's also one generation. So the Quran came during his time. And then when the Quran came, it was in its special language. That is the Arabic. So I suppose not to go here, but I want to make it very clear to you. So it was um, a certain man called Jotzel. It was Jotzel who interpreted, who first interpreted the Quran from where? From the original Arabic language into English. Do you understand? For people, that was the first Quran translated. Do you understand? So the Almighty God, any, uh, any generation with the book he gives to them. And then all those books, they were stated here. That they were revealed. Get it right. Revealed, not written. Do you understand? So this, our generation, it is the Quran that has been given to us. Do you understand? That has been given to us. Do you get it? If you have any backup question again, you can go. No, please. Now, are you... Are you all right? Okay, no problem. But 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 before question, you know, manager, men you know baby ah, na men kada say waraka and the prophet Muhammad almost ninety three years and yano kwe. Now what are they? Uh, I don't need Waraka to know. I know you're a woman. And so I'm not trying to And I'm not trying to do it. Maybe research I'm not trying to do it. research I'm not trying to do it. Maybe research I'm not trying to do it. Oh, that's right, that's right, that's right. I'm going to say, oh, that's right, that's right. That's right, that's right. That's right, that's right. That's right, that's right. What is Christ? That's right, question. Yeah. Salam alaikum. Yeah, wa alaikum salam. Abraham, okay, can we look at Oko two verse view from the Quran? Oko two verse view, verse view from the Quran. Yeah. Let's just say, Quran is say, mumbo mumma no, mumbo mo here no. Mhm. Ne, ebrona eba bebu here no. Oh, what trend is say no se pe? Let me present me bow, me busa o se. Saka muna. O kunjeni tre se yambo ya man. O pa tre se yambo ya yere o ba na bolo. O pa tre se yang karatu o mu anase nye de. Nye de. Yang karatu o mu brutality. Anase de. Ah ja se. Ah o ba na o ba na o ba na o ba na o Yo. Eh. Eh. Akwe se me katra o se. O ba na so o de. Inti ya o bono. Bo akoda no so. E o ba na de be bono. I don't need se fakin. Cho bibi di papa. Ubi di aba, inti kura na yekai yano. Verse ne se bono. Tianya mi na baby sami question se den wati yafem bono. Bono biya ya bono. Man kase man mi enye sa na mi patro. Na upa chese. Because there were so many type of ebro bitches. Ti ti wo as a Muslim no. Osha ebro ben anko akan. Da bisa un opa mi no sa ebro no sa ebro no ye na osa obusa ese ese na yangu bon etse se yangu amu. Ba o o o o Enti na yapa debate no ena me me ko to say Quran say she wayere me ba enti it is your scholar who should explain say bonu nenie na o tire no so so man in tire baby Quran no in me ba need to control Islam Islam wo hands me me ba but who can English na translation no o mo di bibi shape bracket ni enka ho Ah, let's say ya o doje no o no me me doje be na me pepo be do interpretation hello into no o no mistake no o chire me say e bro say say o bo na sum kra ho mo no madalla enti eno ba o bo na sum ho mo no eno no o chire ba ta ho mo no e na me say moral lesson chire say ya moya yire never ya moya yire as simple as that. As a free thing, come in. No, it's not simple as that. I didn't have a question. And she.
I think this is the last question for Shaikh. No, no. Uh huh. So this is. Me bacho. Yebra peni e kasano. Yeah. O kase me ba se yeti ba yanti insemo o kani ye. Insemo ni se. Yeah, waha ni na kwa yanti ni yini waha. Say benya that you have in view of how you Please, I'm coming. Please, please, the noise. Please, 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 please. Then I make an essay. I say, my Anna, Okano, Yenate by Anti, I say, my Naka say, and I say, Yenina, what you intend in your wa, said that you behave in view of how you never could be in your bishop. Also, Okasano will say, So why, young Muslim, what? Unya, Sakwano, and Kobi. Yes, and to me, present who said. So ye Christo ni o, so ye den, so ye den. Ji se me be ye Muslim on Guana. Me nya kwen ako. Ana se ma nye Muslim na me bo ma bra bo na ya. Me ko ana me nko. Me na mpese mi hu. Yes. So based on your question no. Based on your question no. You talking of salvation, isn't it? Very good. If you are talking of salvation and you are asking either to become only a Muslim that will mandate you to go to heaven or something like that. I stand by saying yes. Why? Because I can prove from this. And then, apart from this, there is no other book that has said, if you believe in this religion, you will go to heaven. If you believe in this, you will go to heaven. That is why the Almighty God said, if you believe, if anyone believes in any other religion, that will never be accepted of him. And that person will be loser in the day of judgment. So I've got it from the Quran for you. And then apart from the Quran, we cannot get it here. We have the this thing, we have this scripture that Bhagavad Gita. It cannot be found in there. So this is a claim and this is a challenge. And no ban, no document, no scripture was able to meet the challenge being thrown by the Almighty God in the Quran. So I stand by saying. If you don't hold on to Islam and you die, right? If you don't hold on to Islam and you die, you will be a loser. If you still don't understand, you also produce an evidence showing that if you belong to this religion and you die, salvation is going to be yours. Apart from the Quran, no other. Let me repeat myself again. Apart from the Quran, no other book is making these claims. Apart from the Quran. If there is any other book, come and then open it for me. I will read and I will give you 100 Ghana CDs for credit. So, apart from, Quran, uh, apart from Islam, apart from Islam, there is no salvation for anyone who dies without being a Muslim. But, a Christian from some church in the must say, Sewan Baji Obano Endia. Very good. And also a Christian verse. Now, I want you to quote me. Do you get it? I want you to quote me where the scriptures of the Christians saying, if you don't believe in Christianity, because here we're talking of religion, if you don't believe in Christianity, you'll go to hell. According to, you know, I want a similar challenge. You know, I want a similar challenge from this. So please, no, wait, wait. Come back. No, but we need to, we need to consider this. You need not to be running away from answering questions, answering your questions. So I also put a challenge. The Quran has made a claim. Which, which scripture again is challenging the Quran? I'm yet to see it. Yeah, Abraham. I am Amin Diko. Amin Diko. Amin Diko, yes. Okay. Yes. Please, Mr. Abraham, I want to know if being, if being unfair, if you are unfair, will you, like, will you be classified as a common sense, like you using common sense or not, if you are unfair? You are unfair. Yeah, if okay. someone is unfair. Oh, oh. So that, it, yes. If someone unfair. shows injustice. Injustice. Yeah, exactly. That's the right word. Will you be classified as someone who is not using common sense or not? Okay, okay. Will you be? Uh, yes, yeah, yeah, you'll be. 
we have to understand the meaning of the word common sense. Yes. Uh, common sense. If you are being unfair, that we have to understand common sense before we, we will understand whether being unfair. Okay. Okay. Uh, classify like, you as using common sense or okay. Not using right sense. now, if I am to judge between two people, okay, between two things. For example, you are a free thinker. Yeah. You are a free thinker, right? And I believe you are judging between two uh, two things. Judging between yeah. two people, yeah. You are being unfair. Will you be classified as you being a common sense? Not using common sense. Common sense, common sense is, the, is the sense of good judgment. Good judgment. So common exactly. sense gives you, gives you a the, sense of, a being, sense of being fair. Judgment. Being yeah, no, exactly. who is right and who is wrong. And I'm sorry to tell you that I don't find what you are doing fair. Why? Why? Because in your uh, uh, submission yeah i i believe and i overheard you saying something like if you are to understand the quran you must read the hadith yeah and please i also want to make a reference sorry to bring this on that's why i you know i became okay. the last just okay i just want to make a reference sorry to say this but when uh also Bempa, okay made a uh, statement about Sharubu too you came online and you made people understand he also been quoted some a verse a verse yeah a verse in the quran surah 10 94 exactly and you even interpreted the word the the the, the line correctly for also yeah you understand what i'm saying and later on you made also Bempa and even the people i'm 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 even part of the cs oh okay okay so you made a also Bempa and the remaining people watching online to know that to understand Quran, you must read hadith. Yeah. Because the hadith unravel some explains certain things, things, things you won't understand. The, the same as uh, in Jew, Jew, you know, in, in Judaism, 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 you need the Talmud. Talmud and uh -huh. yeah. So in your submission, like there are a whole lot of people online watching us, and I think the people online watching us are more than the ones those here. here. Yeah. But you were here bringing us Quran words which says cut off your hand, beat your wife. But you are not backing up with any hadith which people were online. Excellent. Watching you with Excellent. You know, even the people online are mostly Christians. Yeah. We, they need you to unravel the, the mystery you are putting them Excellent. in. Excellent. So I feel like you are being unfair. Boss, hold the microphone. You should have directed this to your imam. No. Nope. I am here. Okay. to disprove islam um, so if there is any hadith backing your imam should yeah. tell me avram say avram you don't know islam this is the quran verse and the hadith explanation avram. and nobody can nobody can bring a wrong hadith interpretation in my presence no nope. so i told you that is not my work it is the work of your scholar okay I know. It I am here. Nah, 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 so no. Listen. Let us be fair here. Okay. So I have been justice to the topic. You have to wait after the debate. Call your sheikh and tell him next time. If anybody disproving Islam quotes the Quran, kindly go oh. into. Um, let me learn. Let me learn. It is not my duty to quote your hadith for you. I've studied the verse, studied the hadith, and I know what I'm saying is what it is. So it was up to your sheikh. To use the hadith to explain. So it wasn't my work. And so, sorry, please. La, la, last thing, last thing. And last I believe, I believe, I believe, you know, the most, the most, please, please, just last statement. Last statement, last statement. Last statement. It's, it's actually, it's, listen, please. It's, it's actually not, 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 not a question. No, listen, listen. Listen, listen, listen. It says in the, in the Quran, Surah Al Maida. Chapter five, verse thirty-eight. Yeah. I I believe. Oh. Let me hold this. Let me hold this. I believe if you are talking about common sense. Yeah. I believe Quran is the most commonsensical thing that you could ever ever come across. That's your opinion. Because listen, that's your opinion. Listen, listen, listen. Go to the point. That's listen, your opinion. Listen. In Surah Al Maida, you 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 quoted a line which. You say cut off the hands of both male thieves and female thieves as the rocketer of what they end as a as a deterrent ordained by God. 
God is superior and he judges correctly. Yeah. You quoted only one verse. Yeah. That's I believe it's out of context. When Why? you come listen, when you come down the line, look at the common sense thing the Quran right I said. It says, But whoever turns around his wrongdoing and reforms himself, God will accept his turn around. God is most forgiving and most beneficial. I'm coming. Let me let hold, hold the mic. Don't go. You made a point. Stand. Yeah, oh no, no, it's okay. I know it's there. The Quran says if you catch a thief, what is the punishment? Cut off the hand. Cut off the hand. Yes. But if he does what? So if if you are trying to So are you telling me yes. I'm coming? Okay. Are you telling me you don't believe in the cut the hand? But you believe in when he repents. So no, 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 no. It, it's not it's part of the Quran. The Quran says cut off the hand. My problem is why God who cannot even have mercy on a thief to cut the hand. You know, without rules, we are like savages. You know that. I know. Yes. And we don't need God to make rules for us. Thank you very much. When we are crossing the street, watch left and right. Do you need God to tell you? Please. Please, patience. We are left with only one person. But, but there was a place the Quran made an explanation, and Brother Avram said, You shouldn't read it. The light. Beat them lightly. And so the backers is Hadith. Hadith is explaining it. Yes. Um, please, quiet, 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 please. You're very bright. Okay. Yes. Um. Okasa e muno. Ne ne um. Brother Moshe Kasa e muno. Okase. Ose. Sada makasa ti. Ose. Muslim no. Okotui, ewo Quran ni mu se obi e boni a ye ntwa ne nsa wanka se se ye okowi apontin a eni ye ntwa ne nsa eni okowi na ntwi a ye nya no ana o se ti asem ni ye no se ase ye papa ya be kan bi o se se o repentia se o ja onu ne ho a was a son of Bonnie and Yamedi Betchen. And I must say, 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 a cannon, Sanoa, Nessie, or Sachra, and Sabain, or the Bequa Coye, Juma, and Tichre, or Koran, Nimu, and my young who say, say, a cannon, Sanoa, Yanko Pombe Sabons, a full for their channel, and Tisa Medoboni, Chowan, so they are, never be a me, will be a me, ye free mu, and Tima Mons, a full na odi akwa akwa koye ejuma bi o ana o sa kasa no mu no let me come to your first question but um i'm coming i'm coming please be patient be patient yeah. now there is something that i want i want you to continue on this proverbs i want to speak to you although my chi is not strong that is why i didn't want to go there now no problem i understand in, uh, very well chi there is some adage that says, a bufu semba ta kola kuma hu. Tiyasu. O se diye yin. En fa abane tiyano. Ya di abane tiyano an kwa ye diye yin. No we jai. No we jai. Very good. In ti sa abano a. The king. That according to your adage. That when the. When you know. You spare the road. You spoil the child. You get it. Sparing the road to spoil the child. So when you spare the road. By always allowing the person go, 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 go over every day by stealing, stealing, stealing. Now, you know, if the international bar is not used on that person, on that child, do you understand? Yes. Now I can now sacra if in your oyemu. But 
se onya kunu via ovia ovia na just still nothing is being done to the person the person will go over do it do it do it that is why whenever someone steals and the person is jailed when the person comes out from jail you will just see him being a repented person do you understand and then according to the quran abraham said to understand the quran you need to use the hadith do you understand if you need to use the hadith then the hadith will let you know the hadith is going to make it very clear to you the kind of things are osi munwia ana adebi wo honma wo be wia wo be den wo be twan nsa me ba until first i gave an example that let's take it something like this water when you steal this water no punishment of that sort is going to what is going to be held at you but there are more bigger things that when you steal ma, ma those punishments will be held at you ma tidi o kan na se na ma me mu sha o eh eh aden na esese ye wisu hadith na ye the support to quran no na you as a sheik o wan wisu hadith o kan ye no wan wisu hadith o re bata no wan wisu hadith na wan fa nyina no se hadith ni ka se ntidi e wo kan wo boa very good wan ye we very good you know sometimes Can I continue? Ma 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 me fa we nka ho na wa wie na ma wie Let me let me answer your question okay. first. Okay, please. Let me let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. The Quran, right? When we talk of the hadith, that is the commentary of the Quran and the, even the Bible, we have its commentary. Do you get it? So, as I explained to him, I made it very clear. The hadith is making it very clear that there are some amount of did, did you hear me say that i said there are some amount of commodities and that is coming from uh, the hadith it's making it very clear because the hadith is to explain things very clear to you and then the hadith has made it very clear that there are some amount of commodities that when someone sells that punishment me, should be used me, against me him, not just any other thing me that's it my last one um okasa no see let him, let um, him topic let him say, topic in say mm -hmm. which religion and worship is accepted by god yes now brother moshe kasano o si we dwane afri topic in home i said it you o si we dwane afri yes now ono o che ni believe awo mhm mm any the o jidie mm -hmm. and i know the change to go to quran mhm e di yeye ano o tu ko tu quran but o ko tu ni quran no o se we dwane afri ho wa asa wa ko tu quran na no na me ntia se no please please listen <laughs> listen to me in the first hand please let me answer this question okay please attention please you know So, you know, I said it. Abraham ben Moshe diverted from the topic. I said it and I'm repeating again. He diverted from the question. Nti asema obi same no. Say me can see we free topic ni so no ani o free topic ni so wankasa utie ya. Asema anka e was say eba based on the topic no that didn't come. He left the question and did something different altogether. That is all. Oh, thank you very much. We are giving each of them only and only 30 seconds for their closing remarks. Only and only 30 seconds. After that, I'll take the mics from them for their closing remarks. Then after that, we only 30 seconds. Yo, I'm say, the Bibia be ready to better organize us. Nasi, no matter CSF or ne, you know, no more criminal from being nasi. The best friends are watching ano. You know, that is seventh. Na to me am my kind of a question na you to me upon them to but that will be the answer you don't want to any more more social media you know uh mashallah in conclusion to all this i want to use this medium to extend my greetings to camel glass cold store and uh other organizers together with uh cashman himself for their effort towards the success of this program inshallah
tomorrow's topic is uh, going to be something very tremendous. That is, uh, is the Quran divine. So we'll be pleading with you to be here on time so that we can digest these issues. We can have more time for questions and answers. I also thank my sweetheart, my wife, for her support. Thank you very much. Attack there. Brothers, tomorrow we are starting as early as 7.30. But please, tomorrow morning there will be Musabaka, regional Musabaka here. Champions League. We call it Champions League. It is Ashanti, the champions of champions. So you are all invited to come and witness. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.